Pre stream dance, pre stream dance, gotta do that pre stream dance. Pre -stream pee pee dance, da pee pee dance, gonna pee pee in my pants. Pee please, please be live. Okay, we're live. Hello, everyone! Let's play. Oh, my <laughs> No! That was Go on the stream! Away! I gotta raid Shadow of Legends ad for this stream right uh, as we start. This is unfortunate. Stream's canceled. The stream's canceled, everyone. Go home. Bye. Hello, City Pyra. Hello, Necro Boy. Hello, John Hummel. Hello, Space and Mark. Hello, Hate Lil and Toledo. Hello, Andrew. Hello, Alex Stidham. Hello, Mr. Sir. Hello, Nikhile TV. I think you're new. Hello, welcome. Um, Did I just hear raid Shadow? No. Oh, it wasn't was... my fault. I clicked on the stream on my phone. Yeah. And I got. <laughs> he got Raid Shadow, Raid Legends. Shadow Legends. I don't know. Disappointing. Disgusting, anyway, even. Uh, Carlos Pines45, hello. Anyway, for those of you who don't know, my name is Hedgehog. I'm joined by. This thing. He's, he's the Dragon 100. He's a statue. He I just have him here. And we're joined no! by Pickle Rick. You can't even see him. Uh, the there you it is. Hold on. Angle it. Fuck, I hit the mic. Wow. <laughs> Unprofessional stream. Yes. Um, I just want to let everyone know that James, with his new job and hard earned money, decided to buy me a gag gift for Christmas that came in now Pickle Rick the board game. <sighs> I just wanted to let everyone know. Yeah, no, get, get it out of my sight. You'll never actually play it. Pickle, no. Pickle, pickle, no. Get it, rip, get it out of my sight. Um, I'm sorry you're done. sick, Andrew. What do you need patrons for if you're sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends? Oh, no, there's no sponsor. They just put their ads on every video. Everything. Everything. Every app is sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. Yes. Raid um, Shadow Legends owns the world. <laughs> Uh, how's the sound quality out there, everybody? Is the is the audio to us is that good to go? I always get paranoid. Anyway. Speaking of jobs, money, sponsorships, tax evasion. Tax evasion. The first game we're playing today is Turnip Boy commits tax evasion. Oh, yes. Hold on. I gotta adjust this so I can make sure I can. Yes. So um, yeah, we're playing. We're playing Turnip Boy Commits Tax Evasion. We're playing four games tonight. This is the first. Uh, two of them are very, very short. That's why they were, there are four instead of three. Because mm -hmm. we wanted to play nothing, but it's like ten minutes long. The game nothing. Not the game sitting nothing. here in silence. No, we are going to sit here in silence and just stare at you all. That's the plan. We're playing this game. All right. Here we go. No, we're not. Tax bill. Failure to pay will give Mayor Onion the deed to your house. Why is owned. I didn't know this was Dragon's Life Simulator. I know, right? <laughs> Almost the exact amount, too. Yep. Mm-hmm. Uh, uh, what? Yeah, one hundred and forty-three thousand seven hundred and fifty-two dollars. Sincerely, the government. So, for those of you who don't know, Hedgehog's Grab Bag is kind of a series where we play small indie games. Oi, wake up! You have. I you. I feel like you have to. Give him a nice little mayor voice. The mayor or a mayor? Either way. Boy, turn up, boy! You really screwed yourself! <laughs> I'm so glad. Huh? What do you mean, what? You committed tax evasion! Oh? Yes, tax evasion is a real thing! It is? I thought it was made up. I thought you just I don't have to pay taxes. I thought you made it up for the plot of this game. Yeah. Anyways, you owe me a lot of money, and you obviously have none. So consider yourself my personal assistant. You're like being a weird version of the mayor, and like, what's the what's the Overwatch character you're gonna do? It's like Junkrat. Yeah, you're doing a weird. Yeah, I'm not doing move. exactly the mayor. <laughs> uh -huh. I want to add weird flair because this mm -hmm. game is weird. This game is very weird. Alrighty, we haven't even played it. We I, know it's yeah. weird. So first, head over to the barn. I'm trying to set up a town hall there, but there's a bunch of animals I need someone to take care of. Kill the animals. Uh. Wait, you can avoid taxes? Not legally. Ha! 
Bring me back a bag of fertilizer as proof or you'll be sleeping with the rotten. Someone clip Hedgehog's voicing for this. Uh, you people uh, You people always claim that you're going to clip things, then you never do. You fucking cowards. Clip them. I dare you. Post them on the Discord server. We have one of those, it's in the description below. Nobody ever checks this. Nobody ever checks this. Okay. Here we are. Oh, the animation's so bouncy. Oh, it's I love so it. It's so bouncy. Look at it. Yo, it's here to believe. You ain't gonna believe this. Where do you post? Please in content. Dabu di dabu dai, dabu di dabu. Yeah. All in of. Content. All of the. Wait, are you cursing? Yes. What the fuck? We're cursing? How can. Fucking curse at me? On this goddamn shitting fucking ass. Christian stream? Turn up boy plays tax evasion? My Christian turn up boy yeah. tax evasion server? Yes. You're gonna fucking swear? Yes. You bitch? Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, Patty Rowe, how's doing today? Doing's, doing's pretty good. I, my, my dog doing. It's, it's pretty good. Uh, what? Well, they asked, how's doing today? Doing good. Jerry has been crashing in my place for a week and he hasn't paid a cent of rent! We're good acquaintances, but I don't speak much snail. Jerry the snail. I know, but he's Starla! You know, like Gary the snail. No. It's Jerry the snail. No. Yeah. Hey, look at all these people we can talk to. Let's talk to the snail. Oh! Nice. No, we don't want to talk to the snail, I guess. I want the angry. Is it a radish? Yeah. That's a beat. He's a beat. Ever since that freaking Mayor Onion took over, this town's been a mess. Uh. I like how oh, it's Justin talk. Yes, he Onion doesn't talk. Boy. He just makes noise. Turn up boy, rather. Turn up boy. I mean, look at this path. It's obviously over, absolutely overgrown. Uh, please don't curse. I am a 10 age. You should not be watching. Then you should them. not be watching the stream. I have never claimed to be for children. If you do not like cursing, you yeah, may please. not watch. Yeah, I would recommend not watching. There will be a lot of curse and a lot of things that you sh probably shouldn't hear yet. Yes. Like you need a heckin' a heckin' sword to get through this mess. That's right. You can get a sword. A sword. Okay. Are these things going to attack me, or are they just no? Okay, I can talk to them. Meow. <laughs> meow. Mega meow. Mega meow. Mega meow. <laughs> Hello! Oh, oh my god. The uh, moment I saw it. Have you seen what a watermelon university? I love this game. Uh, what? How about Jujubei's wacky wall trip? Uh. Yeah, whoa, that cherry across the way is something we see seen it. Ooh. Mm. My cat and I will be watching the cat apple returns tonight. Actually, what if my cats went away? If you could keep an eye out for it, that would be perfect. Debita, hello? This is. <laughs> Stop. Stop. Do you think, like, this live stream is not for kids? It certainly no, is not. No, it's... It is not. It is I not. know this game looks very child friendly, and it probably the game itself is, but the people playing not. it are very not. We yeah. are not. Not safe for kids. No, never. No, 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 no. How many people I can talk to? Uh, well, I've been traveling around and studying the aftermath of the Great Fungus War. Apparently, these big spotted animals used to roam the land. I'm glad they aren't here anymore. Seems like we live in what used to be called farmland. Isn't that nifty? Galaxy Potato, welcome. This is. Turnip boy commits tax evasion. Turnip boy commits tax evasion. Uh. Now it's just our home. Cool. cool thank you. Barbary. Hello. Ah! All these flowers. Yeah, I'm not really sure where they come from. Uh, but they're pretty nonetheless. Thank you. Music is bopping. It is so bopping. It's got it's other got, blueberry. It's, other blueberry. You get to be this blueberry. Hi. Ah! Oh, oh, sorry. I'm a blueberry. <laughs> You're a turnip. Ah! Goodbye. 
Badly of such durable welcome. Uh, Lil and Toledo, thank you very much. West for North Forest, West Barn. I love that this cherry has a nose. I know. Oh my god! It's a JoJo <laughs> Is that a motherfucking JoJo <laughs> Menacing cherry. Menacing too. cherry. Yeah, it literally is. It literally this is, is fucking fantastic. Oh my god. I take it back. Worst game ever. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Okay, let's see. We can get a watering can. Oh! This is to grow plants. Used to be old man lemons, but you obviously need it more. The X to use items. Okay. Oh, it's an, oh, okay. an old man lemon. Yeah. Oh, well, hello, chap. Have you seen my watering can? Uh. My eyes aren't what they used to be. Uh. Oh shoot, where'd they go? Where'd you go? Oh, uh. oh there you are. As I was saying... Uh. That watering can means so much to me. I really hope no one stole it. The only thing I have left from the old lady. You stole his dead wife's watering can. I did. You sick fuck. I am evil. Hey. Hello there. Isn't the weather lovely? Ugh. Just as lovely as that strawberry across the street. They're so nice. Hey, could you water this plant for me? Ugh! I ran out of water and want to give this special flower to that special strawberry. They're in love. That's sweet. I hope the strawberry doesn't look bad. I got a flower. Can I go give it to the strawberry? Uh, maybe. Who is the strawberry? That you was are. me. Oh, I use the same voice. That's oh, fair. Boy, thanks for the flower. Ah! Oh, they don't feel the same. I'm sorry. Ah! Oh, it's not from you? Uh. The floor is that this my way of swing. Uh, maybe I should go talk to Do them. Do it. Do it. Set up a date. I posted a voice clip on Discord. Beautiful. Thank you, John. I hope it's- I'm a blueberry! I do too. Thirsty plants ahead. Watch out. <laughs> oh, they're all hot and bothered. They're thirsty plants. They're thirsty plants. Okay, that doesn't matter. All right. Old man's wife is gonna haunt you. Yep. Watch out for the snails. They eat people. Okay, that does nothing No, you, you need the sword for that. I figured, but I wanted to try. Get the sneak How do I post them. voice clips on Discord? So, when you clip something- yeah, and you have it saved, you can go boys. on Discord and then just post a file in content. I want to water the boy. Sword. Oh, I got a sword! It's dangerous to grow alone! Take this! Never mind, worst game ever. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. This game has a very good understanding of the internet. Yes, it does. Like, oh god, it literally is Zelda. It oh, is. you're just bre Break all the grass! Break all- do you want me to break all yes. the grass? Now what are these things? I can't Bushes. do anything with them. I hate oh, the burp sounds. I do too. Like you're eating Stop. them. Stop. No. Just... You're the one who wanted me to break all the grass. No, I don't mind that. I just hate the burp sounds. Um. One hit okay. KO. That's a... One <laughs> tax One dollar reward. Hello, Nickinator. Welcome. Rip it up. We don't want your kind here. Oh shit, nice. forgot the Bundies. Listen. Oh, it's Beat again. It's Beat. Mm, there seems to be a Planticus Sorticus over there. Only I had a watering apparatus. 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 Eh. Sorry. Um. Now it's not gonna give me any hearts, you know? No, now that you're missing one. Oh, there we go, okay. Okay, what well, do we need we the sword go... for over here? We needed to go to the farm, to the barn in the west. Oh, to because... kill something. Yeah, because we're we're now his slave. Oh, I turn it. This is the uh, same this dialogue. This is the same dialogue. Yep. I'm not repeating it. Nope. Should I kill this for him? Yeah. What does it have to say about that? <laughs> you were the blueberry. 
Oh, this I was this blueberry. Yeah. Oh my god, bro! Why did you kill Jerry? Ah! They were defenseless. Why? What do you mean? They hit us. Kill him too. Kill him too. Can you actually kill people? I do you wonder. want me to try? Kill the blueberry. No. No, you can't. Okay, thank God. Hedgehog, why? I was so scared. Jerry was a menace. Jerry was a fucking menace. Okay. There we go. Snails. Oh god, that's worm. a worm. Oh, he takes multiple oh. hits. Trophy. Can I sneak around the back of the barn? I would assume so. Hello, Mizutoka. Why does this game give me Stardew Valley slash Toy Story vibes? Chunk of gold that makes you feel good. It has Hello, a, it pencil has that, type. Welcome. Um, that Stardew Valley art style. Yeah, uh huh. Right. Pencil tip surf jokers, I'm actually here for a stream. Whoa! Welcome to the welcome stream. Welcome to the stream. I'm sorry it had to be this one. You, welcome. Okay, uh, right, so now I gotta switch. Water. You can get bombs. This is just Legend of Zelda. It is just Zelda. Blueberry. Hello? Can't do anything with it. Maybe you hit it with your sword? Run. Okay, yeah. Bomb flowers, water at your own risk. So, you probably can't grab them. You probably have to water them in yes. areas or something. Okay. Let's go this way. Now it's just Binding of Isaac. Yes. Yeah, it literally is just a reference to the internet. This is fantastic. This is great. I love it. It's such a cute little game, too. Okay. Destroy the child. I got... Boom, bloom, Oh, boots. I can kick them now. Oh, I see. Okay. So okay. yeah, you water them and you kick them around the room, probably, yeah. is the mm -hmm. puzzle. Mayor Onion's office. Feel his money. Feel his money. How did you do your taxes? William Storm. I saw Boom Flower. Destroy the child. Corrupt them all. Hello, Mr. Sir. Welcome back. This is a I huge hope meme you're... game, huh? Yeah, I would say I so. I hope you're back from McDonald's. I hope you're safe and sound. Oh, Ronald McDonald didn't... <laughs> Didn't do anything oh. dangerous. Oh. Violent. Run into a boom bloom after it finishes growing to kick it. Okay. So you have to water it first. All right, I gotta. Yeah. Gotta water it, and then I gotta. Run into it. Nice. That's fun. I got a key. All right, don't have my sword. I just keep wanting to break the grass and see if anything special comes of it. Okay, I gotta go. Boom. Yay. Have you committed tax fraud yet? Yes, that is that is the start of the game. We committed tax fraud at the beginning. Oh, yeah. okay. oh god! Okay. okay. Final boss. So I think what I have to do, it looks like, is I have to... When he bumps in and he's dizzy, you have to... I like that. Or do that. That works too. I was gonna say you can hit him with your sword, but I guess not. Okay, there's a bunch of Chick chickens. You have to kill the chickens. Do I? Yeah, because remember he said he wants to. I can't believe you guys them. committed tax fraud without me. I know. Ventus is the perfect game. I know. <laughs> Ventus, come join us in a committing tax meme fraud. Game yes. About tax fraud. Yes. Wow, rude. Chickens only do a fourth of your heart. Yes. Okay, now how do I get this? You have this... to kick it. But how do? Oh, I guess I have to kick it in a diagonal direction. Yeah. Okay. I wasn't sure if I could do that. But... I don't know if you can. Guess we'll find it. Oh, you just kick it out. Or not. Or not. Wait. Water it again. No, it only goes. Only goes. But there's an arrow pointing upward. When you, when you water it again. Yeah, the arrow points arrow pointing it. up. Go to the... Just... Oh, there's there's another bomb over there. Yeah. Oh, I see. You know, you have to kick this bomb into this one, kick that bomb into oh, this one. Oh, okay. One. Okay, that's what I it I didn't is. realize that the rocks were covering the bombs. Okay. Yeah, it's just a, that makes just a little sense. puzzle thing. Okay, there we go. The arrow just tells you where you're going to kick it, not where you should kick it. Yes, uh-huh. There we go. Now we got this. 
Convenient to have Sitting these flowers Sitting to destroy the stones. Yeah. We got it. We got it. Eventually. This... <laughs> We're just a little slow. I'm not a little slow. I'm very slow. I'm only a little slow. That's a lie. Oh, God! Ate a ton of fertilizer. King pig. Water all the bombs. That's what I'm trying to do! That's fine. Oh. Ah. He's dead. He's fucking dead. Three hits, he's dead. It's oh Zelda. my god. Oh Jesus Christ. Get the bacon. Throw it. Throw it. Ah. Gives you another heart. Another heart. That's some pig. Nice. All right, we did it. Oh, the, the, the oh, you gotta go uh, left. Oh, is there another door? Because we went up. To oh, this you're right. There is another door. I didn't see it. Fertilizer. Fertilizer. Too rare to use. Makes things grow like crazy. Eat it. <laughs> I don't think we can, but. No, I don't think so. Oh, now we're at the back. Behind, but... Oh god. I think the trophy was supposed to be for after we win. Probably, we just went around the back and stood <laughs> like assholes. Fine, we don't need it. We don't need the satisfaction. No, that's fine. Okay. Go to him, the, the mayo. The mayo. I like how you have a sword stabbing him in the throat <laughs> yeah. right now. Thought you took care of those animals oh. then. Uh. All right, so your next task as my assistant is to get me a fork. A fork? I'm going to eat the animals. Oh, use the fertilizer. Huh? Assistants don't ask questions. I overheard Avocado say that there's one in this house that's supposedly south from here. I heard horror stories about a bunch of moldy sweets. Huh? Go check it out, or those moldy sweets are going to be the least of your worries. Oh. Oh, let's see to the demo. That was really short, too. I told this you is it was gonna, gonna be, be short. This is gonna be a short stream. <laughs> I told you this one's gonna be short, too. I yep. was like, yeah, this one's gonna last like 30 minutes because it's a demo. Yeah. Well, see, sometimes demos are longer. Like, I've known a lot of demos are like an I mean, hour. I mean, to be fair, yeah, we played uh, uh, Other was other two for, hours, for, yeah. three hours. Um, but a game like this, the demos are usually short because it's, it's a little cutesy indie game. Yeah. Uh -huh. But this was fantastic. Beautiful. Wonderful. Fantastic. I love it. I, don't have any complaints. No, it's really well designed. I think it's a little bit jittery when you move around because the camera kind of that's, okay, goes that's a little fair. bit behind you. So like when you're in an intense boss fight, sometimes that kind of distracts you a little bit. Mm -hmm. But other than that, no, it's a great game. Trainer Boy is hella cute and probably has PTSD to say, ah, in response to every sentence. Um, but yeah, I mean, the dialogue was very clever. The JoJo reference. Killer. We, we see you. Killer. Um, there was a lot of internet references. Mm -hmm. And video game references. Video game general. references. Mm -hmm. It kind of seems to play like a combination of Zelda and Binding of Isaac. I've never actually played Binding of Isaac, but from what you said, it's yeah, like kind of. Yeah, it, that's the level design was very Binding mm -hmm. of Isaac. Yeah. Um, but no, this was fantastic. I would love to see the full version of. It. Absolutely. Turnip Boy commits tax evasion. Turnip Boy commits tax evasion. Can you play Minecraft? We, we have, have played Minecraft three times in the past. If you want to go to my channel. You can click on my name below the video. You can see all three Minecraft streams. They're very long. They're very long. They're you all know, very you long. You want Minecraft? There it is. Super yeah. Meat Boy? Yeah. A little bit of Super Meat Boy. Well, it's got some Stardew Valley in there. Yep. Well, Super Meat Boy is maybe the same guy who made Binding of Isaac, I think, right? Am I correct in that? You might be. I That sounds about okay. right. Yeah. The animation style, I think, is very similar. Mm -hmm. Um, Evelyn Dolan, hi, sorry I'm late, hello, welcome. Welcome. You're never too late, except you missed the entirety of Turnip Boy Commits to Evasion. You, you can, should be ashamed of yourself. You can go back and watch it. Uh, that's fine, <laughs> I don't mind the time since you can show little games that hopefully get more awareness. I usually prefer indie games and this is why. That's fair. Yep. That's fair. Absolutely. Yep. Pork chops for everyone. Ah! Uh. Ah! Uh, and I kind of like these streams too because then I don't have- we don't have to stream for three hours straight, we can just stream for however long we- Oh look, that's a Kirby reference. I didn't oh, see really? that before. Oh yeah, because I just skipped past that yeah, screen because we. Yeah, that's a that's a Kirby reference. Oh. There's a yeah. This has a lot of references, but it also with all these references is its own thing. That's mm -hmm. that's what I like about yes, it. Yes, absolutely. It, it has maintains the yes. air of being it, its own thing. Absolutely. But it's, are made of references. 
Okay. Well, I would say. Well, I did yeah, probably have. Soul, yeah, soul I do. Okay, so from a really cutesy, fun game. Oh, poor Red X phones. He came just after the game he would have liked, and now uh, we're going to go into. Red this phones, game. Go back and watch Turnip Boy commits tax evasion. Yes, you'll love it. It's we're gonna, fantastic. we're gonna. So you'll have to bring up the chat because this is the game this we've is the full screen. Okay. Yep. So apologies, you're gonna see my desktop for a second because this game would what? not. This game would not uh, run otherwise. And plus, you need to see the beginning. It just kind of starts right in. Oh, does it? Really? It does. Yeah. I don't. Okay. Cool. I'm in. So this is a great transition. Oh, a, a voiceless, voiceless decay. decay. This is what happens when you commit tax evasion. <laughs> this is where you go. Hello? Okay. Binary. I was awake. Oh, I'm... Uh -uh. I could feel... I could hear the voices. So this is just your head. Yeah, you to me. Saying things like, you shouldn't eat that pizza. So this looks really cool. Oh, damn. I really enjoy this. Yeah, it's already really this this looks fantastic. Okay, do it. Can I go through? Okay, that just opens. So it looks like Doom. The voice in a That's way. what I was just gonna say. I have felt this way before. I feel like it's done. To it's probably the, a Doom engine or yeah, something. It fills me with. Or some similar engine, like yes. a 2D, 3D okay, engine. Okay, the mouse is really touching. There we go. That is there a setting for that? Or no, there's no not. settings. I just turned it down to my mouse mouse. I've got ultra gaming mouse. <laughs> ah, not, stuck in the door. No, no, no. You gotta. Okay, there, there we go. go. Yeah, with the perspective, you gotta make it center of the. Yeah. Like presents. Hi. This feels like an ARG. Yeah. I don't. Look quite, quite, quite nice. Now it's blue. <gasps> Daba dee da die. Okay. Oh, yeah, what do we get? oh God, oh, it's shit. a maze. There is no other way. Oh, it's gonna set me back to the. Okay. No, just oops. Oops. Uh, yeah, this will be a game where you'll probably have to keep up with the chat a little bit while I play. It's kind of a- it's one of those walking sim- I cannot be stupid. John but Hummel. This is just if LSD meets depression. Yeah, oh, you know what we do? Someday we need to play LSD later. I've seen it, yeah. I have not just because I wanted to play it myself. Yeah, Edmund McMillan, the guy who made Super Meat Boy did make Binding of Isaac well. You were wasting I figured. time. This is the Hedgehog ARG we've always wanted. Yes. Okay, let's back this. Blue, double D, double D. Okay, double D. D. It's actually more of a teal. Uh. Void has come for you. So what are you doing? I Just don't know. Just walking around in a circle? I'm kind of wandering around. Is there no around? doors? I can't find any. I'm assuming since I'm still doing things that I'm good. I'm that you're good. just sort of. I'm just sort of wandering. Brace me. No, I, I don't want to. Okay. Oh, it's pink. Why? Or purple. It's purple. It's not pink. I mean, it's it is. Pink. It's pink. It's pretty pink. It's purple. The background's all purple, and the stuff around the text is purple, but the center of the text is pink. But it's it's all the same color. Just more intense. It's all one color. It's done in monotone. This is purple. It's all purple. It's all monotone. It's one color. No, ah. that other one was not. The yeah, text was... was white in the center, and it faded outwards, so it's sort of pinkish. It's all oh, supposed tape, to be one tape, color. Tape, yeah, I know. Tape. I'm looking. I didn't want to go right there because I'm afraid the game will fuck with me. Oh. I saw you come to life. You will see them fade away. That was your family. Oh, it's very dark now. Th that was your family. That we was... have them now. <laughs> They're in the Discord server. In the Discord. I tape. No love can break the bonds between. Bonds between. I person's nose. Oh God. This is actually slightly horrifying. Like, I'm digging this atmosphere. Like, usually horror games don't really scare me anymore, but this is. Pencil this Tip is Workshop, what me is. A bit. He says, this reminds me of Ditterpunk. What is Ditterpunk? Ditterpunk. I've never heard of that before. I've never heard of that. 
If it, if this reminds you of it, that might be a good plan to play they too. They have been with you through High everything, art. but now they cannot follow. Ventus harvest, harvest, harvest. <laughs> I'm assuming I'm supposed to kind of enter these areas because it seems like when I do, I find more. Yeah, they're lit up where the tapes are. Yep. Your accomplishments do not matter. We. Oh, that's fun. I can feel it. And the moment you used the generic eye gift, you gone. lost me. This gif, this eye gif is in every horror, every, every like oh, is indie it? horror game I've never ever. seen it. Yeah, I even used it in some of my earlier. Oh, I've like, never seen it. It got yeah. me because I've never seen it before. Well, that's that's soul of voices decay. <laughs> I can feel it coming in the air tonight. Oh lord! <laughs> Thank you, Vettis. That was that was that was an experience. That was. So, but it said it said there were like six. Different ways you could go, though, right? Is there? I thought that was a different game. Wait, go up. There are ten, ten hidden, hidden truths, truths for you to find. Ten hidden truths, yes. I mean, I feel like... Should, should we try to play it again? See if we can do it. Because that was only, like, a couple minutes. I would try playing okay. it one more time. If we go, no, like, look around for other things. Yeah. If mm -hmm. there's nothing else, then whatever. But. Okay. So, my immediate sense on this game... Mm-hmm. The visuals are very good. Yes. Like, this is a very nice atmosphere. Yes, and I feel like that's what this game is trying to accomplish. Yes. Unfortunately, it is ruined by the sort of generic nature of it. That's fair. I will give it that. Like, there isn't. There doesn't seem to be much behind it. It seems like it's supposed it's to be. It's more of just the atmosphere. It's not about. But to be fair, I feel like that's kind of what they were trying to accomplish. This feels oh, like no, an experiment. I, I, don't, I don't at all discredit it for that. I'm just saying it lost points for me when... It's it because it started off as something I've never seen before, mm -hmm. and then it slowly faded into yeah. mm -hmm. everything else. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, again, I made the joke about the eye, but it's just sort of even some of the dialogue, just like yeah, no. we are watching you. It's like okay, well, you're not. There's nothing else here showing me that. Yes. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. That's. I mean, again, the visuals and the environment, the ambience, the sounds. Uh -huh. I feel like I sets feel like a nice mood for it. This feels like it should be some sort of mini in-between game of a bigger game yeah like if there was a game like this is like the hidden element yeah of a there's game. there's mm -hmm. you break into something or you find something and it takes you to this yes that would yeah because then the rest of the game could be you know more about mm -hmm. some some kind of storyline telling some sort of story yeah and then this could add to that element or either that or it could be one of those things where it you know, it seems to be kind of like, if this game was combined with Turnip Boy commits tax evasion, that would be absolutely fucking goddamn yeah, horrifying. Yeah, like it would, need, it would need something that sort of masks it, and then you delve into this kind of stuff. Yes. That would be, I think, the best way for it to, because just as a standalone, it seems rather generic because yes. it's just, hey, spooky environment. Mm -hmm. But if you were playing a game and you, came across this yes it would it would absolutely be bad shit terrifying be fully yeah mm -hmm. but i feel i feel like what this person was trying to accomplish this game was kind of a test for this type of visual no which absolutely they accomplished hands down oh yeah the environment is fantastic the environment is utterly fantastic uh, at least for a demo if this was a longer game i'd hope for maybe a little more variation oh, in it but no of course but just, it's just that it's, it's monochrome not supposed to be it's dot, like seven minutes yeah, long that so. monochrome dot art style is very very effective and very cool and i really want to know how they did it yeah my lips are durable it was cool until the eye and hand came up i'm not sure what exactly it's aiming for i think again i think it's just to set the environment yes. like to just put mm -hmm. you in, in sort of an experience that's yes. weird and uh, yeah. just unnatural I, yeah this feels like a test or like maybe a... you find a bunch of different radios like finding notes and slender kind of yeah i'm assuming it's supposed to again tapes of because it's telling you about your past and stuff like that yes which again if it was in a game mm-hmm would work so much better because then you'd already have the character to yes mm -hmm. connect to and then yeah. you could actually get tapes have you guys ever heard of viscera cleanup detail it's a longer session game and it's a good game to play with friends oh yeah i've heard of that huh. that's a game where you literally clean up dead bodies oh this is new oh it is yeah so it's probably or is it or is it no i think that might not be 
It might not Hold be on, there. let me try going another way. I was gonna say maybe go a different path. Hello, door, please. I I know. No, no that's that was the way the one I you went. went. Yeah, that's the way I went before. Go back. We'll go this way. To be fair, this could just be the center of the area. I mean, yeah, it's probably just the center of the maze, but like potentially picking up a different tape first could go. I don't know. Really fuzzy around. There's a tape. Yeah, no, I think it's same. just the same. Okay. Uh, this is Project Libertina's low-budget demo. <laughs> <laughs> this is like a first-person perspective for when you go into the code in FNAF world. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Where you, you glitch into something, and this would be a cool way to do it. Absolutely. A dream sequence for in-between days of some sort of supernatural, perhaps cosmic horror game. Yes. Like the 8-bit stuff in between Finance of Freddy. Yeah, a lot yes. of people are mentioning Finance of Freddy. I agree. This is sort of like that. Mm -hmm. That's where it would probably work best. Yes, I absolutely agree. Ventures, I mean, you're as... a genius. They're watching the player because the player committed tax fraud. <laughs> <laughs> yes, because even though I'm not a huge fan of Five Nights at Freddy's, that is one element that I do admire in it. The fact that they have these bizarre little mini games in the center of it. Mizutoka said, more variation. What do you want? Green? Don't be greedy. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, I am green. I see. Oh. Okay, this is the last one. Yeah, it comes from the anime. All of the void. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, Watching you. I. Yep. I do like the eye. I mean, if it's the same gift that everyone uses, it, I can see it, how that like, would. I wish it was a different eye. If it literally, if it was a different eye, it would have been so much better. But it's just the eye that everyone uses, so it loses all the charm. And. And the, the hand is also a gift that's on. I think all of the imagery was just found on Google. Yeah, it seems like it was. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But the hand was a. It wasn't scary or anything, but it was a cool. No, yeah. It was a cool mm -hmm. way to end the game. So. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. But. Yeah. Not bad. Was... Not bad. I would say. As it, like a tech demo, it was really, really yeah. good. As a tech demo, there's a lot of potential. Mm -hmm. I would maybe switch up some of the stuff that you, specifically like the eye, maybe the hand. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Um, get original content, even film yourself and edit it that way. That yeah, was... there's a lot of ways to do it. Um, the hand seems to be like their logo, so you could potentially keep that one in. Yeah. I don't see it mm -hmm. everywhere, but the eye is used a lot. Mm -hmm. so maybe spice up a little bit of the wording, like, because just, I am watching you, we are inescapable. It's, it, I see, yeah, I feel like if it had an actual, like, this seems like it's just using yeah. text to scare you. If it had an actual story behind it, you could get more yeah, specific. Yeah, if, you, if, would... you, if you had something surrounding it, then you could sort of paper the the text towards the yes. story mm -hmm. and it would literally it would be fantastic. What? If I was playing a game and mm -hmm. this came up, like if I walked into a wall or something, oh, phenomenal. Yeah. It would be fantastic. One thing they could potentially do as well is they, you know, there's all those tricks that people use to like get your information from your computer and stuff. That could potentially be something they could that do if they be, wanted to go in a different yeah. direction, if they wanted to make it more if, personalized. If they, yeah, if they really wanted to sort of this just be it, yeah, make it more... You could make it more personalized. Mm -hmm. You could also just tell a story through this. Mm -hmm. Like instead of just saying your past, sort of hint at what the past mm -hmm. is involving. Mm -hmm. Like if they killed someone, you could sort of cheekily mention that yeah. in some way. Mm -hmm. That way you as the player have to be like, what did my character do? I'm mm -hmm. in the mics in my way. But what did my character do? There you go. That caused whatever nightmares happen. Mm -hmm. There's Absolutely. a lot of different ways you go with it, but for pure visuals, this was fantastic. Absolutely, I, I loved the sort of style of it. Mm -hmm. uh, John Hummel, I have to hand it to them. The ambience seems good. John yeah. Hummel, I'm timing you out for. <laughs> <laughs> and also, hello, James Bennett. Welcome. You missed um, you missed uh that. So what we do next? So next, we're playing a game called Nothing. Um, it's nothing. It's nothing. It's just so this nothing. game was made for a game jam, actually, and it's about nothing. That's not about nothing. But you start with nothing. Mm -hmm. And so I saw a little bit of someone playing this, and I thought it was really cool. Because it basically the concept is everything's an upgrade. So like you can't walk a certain direction. Mm -hmm. You get that upgrade. Mm -hmm. So hacking mini game for... Yes. Yeah, something like that. Like if you're delving into the code of something, that would be a good way to yeah, do it. Yeah, mm -hmm, absolutely. There's, there's, but that's the the glory of it. You can take it in basically any direction, any direction you want. You want. Mm -hmm. 
I'd love to see so, you do something like that. That'd scare the shit out of me. So I could do that with Click Team's 3D like Firefly engine, mm -hmm. but I'm not spending. Well, of course not. Um, I wonder. Probably be some probably like shader that mm -hmm. you would need to apply over it. I'd assume so. I don't think the effect would probably be all that difficult. I think it's just probably something like it's probably something that they changed a specific setting in a very specific way that made it look like that. Essentially. Anyway, there's nothing. It's just nothing. Oh, the game is unlocked. Yeah. Great. You start with nothing. I start with nothing. Okay. Oh. I've unlocked the music. And the sound effects. The move to the left. You can't move right. I can't move right. I can only move left. Yep, only Great. left. Move my mouse because you can see it. I don't want <laughs> wow. you to see it. Wow. Okay, I can jump now. I just also like how you this little blob. Yeah. Pressing R will restart you from the last checkpoint. Okay. Yeah, basically, if you walk too far past it and you can't touch it. <laughs> Up and down now shifts the camera view. Okay. I'll restart you from the last checkpoint. So it's probably to look down and see where the, the platform is or yeah, something. Yeah, uh huh. Like that. Like that. Because there's spikes falling. He's tapping his little foot. E. I, I can't just liked right. the visual of this a lot. So. No, you can't move right. You can only move left. You unlock the ability to die. Yeah, you haven't unlocked a death. I'm assuming you will die, but I'm just wondering because nice. you haven't unlocked a death. Yeah, I gotta wait for it to be. Yeah. There you go. Ah, shit. Okay, huh. it's fine. It's gonna be a hard jump. Okay, there I did you it. Go. Oh, God, I can't move right, though. Oh, okay, it goes to the left. That's fine. This is hard. Yeah, that's this what I liked like, about this it. This game was... is like DLC Quest. Yeah, yeah. It's cool. I like it. Okay. I think you can jump on those. They seem oh, like okay. platforms to You're me. You're right. Like... Oh, they disappear. That's what it is. Okay, sweet. I was gonna say, they seem like platforms. The crouch and pass through platforms. Congratulations. Okay. Oh, so the, those thin ones maybe up yeah. there. Yeah, these ones. These ones. Okay. Jump. I've unlocked the hunger me- oh. That's- this sucks. That's unfortunate. What was that? Ah, you shit. can't get it. I can't get it. I mean, you can always press R to go back to the checkpoint. I probably will. Oh, Fuck. the checkpoint is their last thing that you got. Oh, is it? Yeah, because look, you're at the hunger. Yeah, you're right, it is. Man. God damn it, I'll have to go back. So you took when the I wrong can... path, I'm assuming. Hey, listen, you unlocked the fairy. <laughs> Only you can see <laughs> oh the Oh my steps. god. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. I never really found Nave that annoying, unfortunately, so you, you're not gonna... You have, to, you have to crouch. Oh, yeah. Died. Shut up. Hmm. Listen, the fact that I've only died once... Hmm. That's your bad at games. Man, just was quick on the draw with that I one. I know, he was, he was ready for it. Hmm. Great ducking, hmm. thanks. Hmm. Hi. So you're playing armless loops from Undertale with brain damage. Yes. Thanks, Navi. Mickey Mouse. Distracting squeaky shoe mode. Oh, fuck! <laughs> run. You can't. <laughs> I can't. You don't have run unlocked. Okay, yeah, I never found Navi annoying. You will soon. I like catchy elevator music. I wonder if they made this music themselves, because all of the sounds in this are very good. They are very good. What's that? I don't know. I'm gonna find out. Super secret blue, blue mode. mode. Oh, no, I'm blue. Now you're blue. All of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles are blue, except for three of them. You went and there, there are instead four. of Dabu Dee Dabu Dai. That is part of Dabu Dee Dabu Dai. It's Aaron's parody of it from... Ah. Uh, uh, what? Yeah, you should have dodged it. I want to be blue. I can't. 
Oh, you can't move right. Can't move right. <laughs> God damn it. That's... I forgot. Ah, <laughs> uh, this game. Long elevator, right? I feel like this game is parodying how games give little achievements for doing the littlest things. I think so. Mm -hmm. I think that's the whole point, is that it was... Hmm. Oh no, what is that? Okay, that's the... Regular music again. All right. Cool. Cool. Oh, you still have squeaky boots. Still like got squeaky. Oh! <gasps> I give it right. Go back. There's gonna be nothing over there. I can run. Oh, dope. Well done. Yeah, that's just. Whoa! What is that? Congratulations. Congratulations. Wait, so go left. What's left? I like being locked with moving in the left since most of the games are getting moved to the right being stuck and the left makes a lot. Oh, you that died. wasn't uh, spike. I wasn't looking because I... Since most of the games have the character move right, being stuck having to go left makes it feel that much stranger. Yeah, I know, right? It's weird. Mm -hmm. It was really weird. Final stretch. I you jumped died. past it. You jumped onto it. I tried to jump past it. I was trying to avoid the spikes. That's a fast boy. And Nave is still being a bitch. Yep. Hedgehog bad at games. Hedgehog is not that bad at games. Exit. Okay. This is alarming. I, I don't, I don't, I don't like feel comfortable this. with this. I don't like this very much at all. Well, I can't get up there. I can't go up there, I yeah. can't go up. I have to go down. Wait, but what's left? What's left? Yeah, I can go left. Bikes. Fuck. Okay, hold on. Come on, come on, come on. Nice. It's the beginning of the game. It is. Because you couldn't go right. Because I couldn't go right. That's really clever. Wow. Okay. That's really clever. Okay. That's cool. Oh, it's Jesus. I... I don't think that's Jesus. That has boobies. I finished the game. Well done. I did it. There you go. I did it. What shirt are you wearing, Hedgehog? My shame. My shame. It is my shame. You called. I'm, I was hoping someone. I wasn't going to do it. I was hoping someone would call mm -hmm. her out on it, though. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, those are all super short. That took us less than an hour to get through three games. <laughs> Luckily, I think Hunters of the Hall is pretty long. So. Yeah. If we, we could, if we finish it really early, we could always throw in another game too, just randomly from the list. We could ask every something. we could we could bring up the desktop image and show my huge list of games. We could we could also just see if anyone has any recommendations. Also that as well, yep. Okay. All right. So, the last game we're playing is Yeah, we didn't think that I mean, I to be fair, I did, but she didn't think that Turnip Boy would I figured be it that last us 45 minutes that short. at least. Okay, anyway, uh, I have to bring this up. This now, um, because this one's kind of stupid. Oh, we need to it because it's made with uh, old, old, old um, RPG old Maker. RPG Maker, yeah. Yeah, 2003. It's the same engine that made off. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's got extra. Well, why didn't you seven. extract it earlier? Uh, because I didn't want to, because I already extracted it once. I want to just, yes, just well, yes, I yes, know. Well. I, you will be sitting there clicking it the whole time. Yes, I know. Okay, here we go. Oh, it extracts it to open. Oh, that's yes. right. Yeah, because mm -hmm. it's dumb. Because it's old. Yeah, we're going to have to look at it really small because otherwise it's full screen. Nah, that's fine. Uh, Bring up the chat, though. Ah, uh, yes. Let me do that. Okay. All right, so this is Hunters of the Hollow. This is a game I've been wanting to play since I started the series. I just never got around to sticking it in for whatever reason. It looks really cool. Huh. I love the art. Did you j giggle? Giggle, sir? 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 Just sticking it in. Oh, was that what you were giggling <laughs> at? <laughs> Just aim, Just aim past, past the rock. <laughs> Huntress, aim past the rock. Uh, thank you, Nickadator. Welcome for, uh, thank you for joining us. Um, have a good night. All right, here we go. We're going to begin. He's having a giggle night. 
pixel boom game made with RPG Maker 2. Once upon a time, in a village far, far away, there lived a young girl by the name of Lenora. Lenora. Uh, there's, there's no shame in wearing a Monica shirt. You like the game for its innovation, but you don't want to bloat your channel and killing it off. Nothing wrong with it. Exactly. There is something wrong with that, John Hummel. No, and I... Hypocrisy. Honestly, it's really like a Rick and... Like, we're going to take a minute because we have plenty of time. Oh, all yeah. right. Um, it's like a Rick and Morty situation. I'll go get Pickle Rick. No, you're not getting Pickle Rick. We're like... I'm going to adjust this camera because it's... We're like... The show is still amazing and it's still great. Fan base is just... Terrible. I mean, it's like everything. Yeah. Everything. Even your your fan base. Oh, yeah. I hate all... Oh. I hate... Uh, 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 no, I mean, <laughs> other than you. No, I mean, surprisingly, other. surprisingly... Except for that this... one comment we read this morning. Jesus Oh, Christ. God. Okay. But anyway, <laughs> uh, no, but most things, you know, the source material is very good, but mm -hmm. everyone either takes it the wrong way or is just awful human being. Yep. Um... And that's DDLC, yeah, honestly, it is. it sucks. I, we still love the yes. source material. The game itself is fantastic. We still love the game, and the instant Down Salvato <laughs> comes out with... <laughs> Gerbil sent the eyes. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'll post it to the Discord server, because I took a screenshot of it to send to, to send to Suburban Neighborhood, so I'll I'll post it to the server after after the stream. Um, but, uh, yeah, just as soon as Dan Salvato releases something new, which it sounds like hopefully he will this year, um, I'll be right on board with doing it again, hopefully. Uh, and I'll just have to deal with the toxic grossness. Ventus, I'm going to post it on the server! It'll be in memes right after yes. the stream. Thank you very much, the Ventus. That's very kind of you. Which I'm come? Wait, don't tell him which. He'll donate more money. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, we won't. Listen, Ventus, I'll send it to you right now if you give me 20 bucks. You won't have to wait until the You're stream is You're disgusting. <laughs> I just Shame know he'll, on I you. I just know he'll do it. Shame <laughs> on you. Ventus, if you make sure I get paid this month <laughs> from YouTube... <laughs> then I'll send it to you right now. There's the delay of the stream. Nah. Good for you, man. Good for you. Don't give in to Finally. me. Finally. Ventus, don't, don't give it to don't her. Don't do me. it. Don't give in to me. But yeah, but I'll just, to, desperate. I'll just have to deal with a shitty fan base and then, you know. But It'll uh, be in memes later. It'll, yeah, it'll be memes later. I'll just deal with a shitty fan base and hopefully some of the old people will what come back. Yeah. It, well, that's just the thing is we were having this conversation earlier, actually, mm -hmm. where the fan base started off really good and everyone realized how good of like an actual horror game it was. Mm -hmm. And then that sort of broke away. And then it became more like the memes, like everyone was making song edits or just mm -hmm. memes in general. Buffsaki became a Buffs thing. Buffsaki became a thing. Mm -hmm. And then that faded away. And then all of a sudden, the kiddos who watched, you know, Markiplier and other YouTubers play it mm -hmm. all came in and started waifuing. And then that's where it sort of culminated Devolved, into this yeah. awful ball mm -hmm. of just not good fan base yeah unfortunately uh, um, but the same thing could be said for undertale for a time i think yeah. it's moved past it undertale so. has successfully matured now i think by the time delta Rune came out yeah. most people were five nights better. at freddy's everyone no. hated each five other five nights at freddy's is still i'm kidding <laughs> there is so much less furry porn <laughs> yes that's fair <laughs> that's fair that's yeah well fair. that's the thing once something gets popular Everyone mm -hmm. sticks to it, even the bad people. Mm -hmm. Red X Phones even is Even the 12 year old kids who don't understand the actual meaning of work. Which I just always feel so bad for Dan Salvador. I feel like that poor guy. Yeah, that please. poor guy. Just as a creator, right. I know exactly what it feels like. People just. Not keep, getting it. Keep bringing your DDLC on it. Can you do the cute waifu scenes? No. Can you do a mod of DDLC? Can you voice it? It's a mod of DDLC, but nothing bad happens. <laughs> anyway, we should get back Ventus to playing your porn game. looking at you at Claude. <laughs> Oof. I can live with a terrible fan base. Yeah, well, yeah. that's like, mm -hmm. that's the same thing with Rick and Morty. That's why she brought it up earlier, is you're, like, publicly shamed if you like Rick and Morty, but the it's because the fan yeah. base is just mm -hmm. The disgusting. only problem I meet having to, uh, being a creator, being a public face, doing this stuff, is that I have to deal with it. Like, if you're just a fan, you could ignore the fan oh, base. Oh, yeah, and just like, pay you could just say, I like the stuff, I hate the fan yeah. base. But when you're someone who's voiced it, you have Everyone to deal still... with all of those comments yeah. all the time, which is unfortunate, but yeah. Hedgehog right, breeds in. Boy. <laughs> Boy. <laughs> anyway, we should get back to this yes. game now. Uh, Lenora was it's an... not like we're in a rush. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> Lenora was an honest, hardworking girl, just like the rest of her family. Remember the Edie Valley Natsuki scandal? Yep. Yes. Uh, she and her mother lived peacefully in the village and wanted for nothing. Ah, yes. 
Happy the Harpy or whatever their fucking name was. Happy the Harpy? Happy the Harpy, yeah. Mm -hmm. Something like that. That was a good time. Every week, Lenora and her mother would prepare a basket of treats to bring to her grandmother, a kind old woman who lived in a little house in the middle of the woods. But nothing bad happens, meaning nothing interesting happens because of how bland DLC characters are. <laughs> Oof. Well, it's sad because it's totally done on purpose. They are yeah. bland on purpose. That's the point. Yeah. So that you get to their horrifying backstories. Yeah, it's literally about a writing club. Mm hmm The most boring thing. <laughs> Shut up. No, but I mean, yeah, it lit I mean, it's that's what it was supposed to be. Something that's sort of dull. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that when the horror happens, it's like... It's like... The fuck? Uh, have you ever seen Trailer Park Boys? My dad watched half an episode once on Netflix when he was bored and wanted to fuck up my recommendations. Because we were on my profile. Mm -hmm. uh, Lil and Toledo, bye. Good mm -hmm. evening. It just so happens that today is the day that Lenora must visit her grandmother again. Like a good daughter, she wakes from her bed, dresses, and runs the stairs of her home to speak with her mother about today's visit. It's I love, riding it. yeah, I love the art style though. Oh no, it's really—it's so nice. Five inches. Five inches. Antivexium. <laughs> well, I guess you have to send Antivexium the. Text yeah. I, okay. All right. <laughs> that came out of nowhere. <laughs> all right. Oh, let me find you, Antivexium. You're now. A, it's easy to find you now because you're a patron. Okay. Hey. Hey. Uh, all right, let's right here. Well, now Anthony Vexium is just gonna post it in memes. Yes. You, now you don't. You know. But it's fine. I got twenty bucks. <laughs> I got twenty bucks. Well, yeah. Now you got you got you get to send it to him, and now you don't have to put it in the server. You don't have to worry about it because you know he'll do it. Perfect. He'll just be like, um, <laughs> is legend. Here for everyone else because I'm out here. <laughs> okay. Uh, movement. Open menu. Uh, confirm. Select. Okay. Sprinting. So basic. Pretty so, yeah. basic control. Lenora cannot hunt wolves stronger than herself. Auto hunts will only auto attack. It will not auto defend or auto restore Lenora. Uh, food and drinks can be found, but try not to waste them. Sometimes avoiding wolves entirely is a better option. Once the hunt starts, Lenora cannot escape until she or the wolves are dead. Okay, so huh. it's so it's got an RPG. It is it's not an RPG a horror game. It's an actual RPG RPG. I think I have to go visit grandmother today. I better give her a better voice. I think I have to go visit grandmother today. I think I have to go visit grandmother today. <laughs> Mom usually wakes me up and makes me- I'm she's just being gonna be Aya now. Yep. Errands before the trip, but it looks like she forgot to do that today. She's out in the garden right I mean, now. I mean, that's different. I'm certain- It's just my Aya voice. No, it's not. Yeah. Aya's a little more breathy, cause- Oh, that's fair. <gasps> Father! Um, she's out in the garden right now. I'm certain as soon as she sees me, she'll tell me whether- uh, whatever it is I need to do today. Yeah, the text is a little small for us, so... Apologies for everyone out there when we stumble over words. Good morning, sleepy daughter of mine. You woke up just in time to get ready to visit your grandmother. Morning, mum. Just as you sit here and I voice all the characters in this it's game. Because a mom, a daughter, and a grandmother, yeah. Yes. So today I needed to visit the shop and the smith for some groceries and a package. Clearly I'm gonna be grandma. <laughs> yes, you have to be grandma. When I'm done weeding, we can get you a basket ready for grandma, all right? Right, I'll be back with your things, mum. Little pink. Little pink. Yeah, I, I get it. This is super cute. Oh no, the art style is fantastic. Super cute. So I love how we went from super cute to horrifying. Cute and Mimi to a very to, back to cute. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> I mean, the point is that they're playing with archetypes and anime, exactly. Mm. To Pokeweed Square, okay. Oh, that's a wolf. Yeah. All right. Attack it, or not. Or it's a dog. Oh, it's a dog. <laughs> Kill it! Kill My it! Dog. Kill it! I can sprint. Yeah. Pokeweed. Can you find wild Pokemon there? Yeah, but it's only Oddish. Yes. <laughs> it's all women. Uh, Dash, you're no, just letting her run outside. There's a scrapping there's young a lad over there. Strapping. Very strapping. No, scrapping. Scrapping. Okay. He's barely holding himself together. Yes. I don't. If uh, if I don't keep a close eye on him, he might run off into the woods. Yeah, it is just a dog with hard eyes. Dog with horses. Hard eye dog. Who's this? Who's this fellow? Baron <laughs> Burberry. Oh! A master of horrible wolf killed my wife a couple of years ago. She was still alive almost every day. Oh, I wish she was I still wish alive. I wish she was still, she was still alive. She's still oh, alive. It's awful. Please, someone oh, help okay, me. Okay, so this just toggles the sprint, so I don't need to hold it. Okay. Okay. I'm just going to walk because it's nice and peaceful. We're not in a hurry. Yeah, the townsfolk might be a little more concerned if the dog was a wolf. Yes. Hi, dude. Oh, Mr. Bladder. Bladder nuts. 
Well, you know, one time the huntsman told me that wolf steaks were actually quite delicious. I don't know if I should believe him. Wolves are all scrawny with, hardly mu with hard muscle. You really must have a gourmet's palate to want to eat a wolf. I'm a bladder nut. <laughs> I have to pee bladder really bad. Oh, so he's just me. Oh, here's the smith. I need to go here. Will Smith. Smith. Will Smith. Smith. Will Smith. Will, Will Smith. Hello. Hello, Lenora. Your most packages are quite done yet. Come back sometime later, maybe a half hour. It'll be good to go then. John Hummel. Dog is stringy. Don't eat canines. I only eat hot dog. I don't. Fries inside. I'm gonna make a. I'm gonna go make a corn dog right. Oh, don't! Don't make me barf. <laughs> okay, then I'll be sure to. Do it as will. Yeah, it's corn dog time. Oh God. Yo, if I could put anything in the microwave, I'd want corn, corn dogs dog. and microwavable weenies. I once saw a massive wolf on the edge of the forest one night, you know. Miss Lopseed. Lopseed. It stared straight at me like it knew me, and as if it as if it knew I had rabbits too. I don't ever leave the village at night anymore because of that monster. I have to protect my rabbits. Neck creak. Neck creak. So that's the good thing about doing a bunch of really fast games, and then we just have for this one. We have all the time. Stop, stop. getting in my way. Okay, here's the shop. We need to go in the shop. Hi. Who's this? This is a Mr. fellow. Kohosh. Kohosh. Good day to you, Lenora. I've got your mother's things right here. Here is one loaf of bread fresh from the bakery. Pumpernickel, Pumpernickel loaf. Pumpernickel loaf. You didn't. You never. Oh, excuse me. Wow, that was disgusting. You never brought back Dusty Loaf this year. I did. Sent. I sent a. Uh, the emote in the. E.D. Valley, and that's it. I didn't do it on, like, Twitter or anything. Wow. Well, you can't expect it to come back with one singular emote in E.D. Valley. It was a hidden loaf. I see. This year. I see. A few slight... Oh, I was wondering if it was just bread. I was like, wow, that was... It's the token dragon A few slices character. of ham from the butcher. I just read the nice. comment. It has to be the most cringe thing I've ever read, and I'm in the fandom. Yes. <laughs> yes. Uh, how do you make dogs out of corn? Carefully. Very carefully. You stole my I knew thing. You were gonna do it. That's why I said it. Don't steal, my, and you missed the very carefully. No, nope, it's not. You don't have to be that careful. Just relatively careful. Don't steal my one thing that's funny that and I do. One glass of bottle of crystal clear water. Thank you, Mr. Kohash. Kill me, please. Make sure to tell your mother hello for me. They are sleeping together. <laughs> That man had eyebrows. That man had Someone eyebrows. Someone said, Quahog, red post the comment. Where is the comment? The comment's in memes, I would assume, because Anti-Vexium had it. Yes. I would assume that is where it is. Yep. All right. Well, now, give me my stuff. Give me my stuff. No, you have to give your mom the food. Oh, I got to give my mom the food, and then I got to come back? Oh, that's mm -hmm. lame. Lame. You have a sprint option. That's fair, I do. We... I just read it. I regret those two books. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Stonecrop said she won't have your package ready until later today. But here are the rest of the things you need. Ventus just <laughs> no. I'm gonna refund you the two dollars. No. I could get a no. diet. Coke you can't get them. You can't get it back. For that money. You can't get it back. For reading hey, he read the comment. I'd be willing to give him the money back. No. No. She no, she won't give it back. No. Uh, I'll steal it from her from her. To feed his diet coke addiction. You know, you don't want to feed your diet coke addiction. I'm, I'm, feed. I'm an intervention. This is an intervention, feed. Ventus. Feed. Uh, thank you, Jay. You can set them beside me. I need to finish plucking these weeds, and then we can have lot. Dazzle wolf. Oh my goodness! What could that commotion be? I don't know, but I'll look and see. Dog's dead. Do be careful, Jay. I'll be by in a minute. Dog's yeah, dead. little girl, go on ahead to see what that horrific noise was. I have a bad feeling about this. Yeah, run in the town after Oh, it's this. making me save. Oh, it was the dog. It was the dog. Oh, no. The village is a complete chaos. And are those wolves? I don't remember any of the voices. Uh, this was... 
Lenora, don't let these beasts come near you. They'll kill you in one bite! Come to us, girl. Don't stand there like a sitting duck. I must kill They'll the kill wolves. In one bite! Oh, I'm gonna run around. But you can begin the hunt. No. I must not. I, I think it's telling you not to. Yeah, I don't have any weapons. They're not- they don't seem all that hostile. No, they're not all that hostile. Look at them, get inside the Baron's house! The village just got nuked! Oh, that was a transition? I thought that was a battle. Just, they're normally they do blurs like that for like a battle mm -hmm. sequence. Oh no, the dog's fine. I just read the comment. I think RB had a <laughs> Let us have a, a second of silence for RB. No, they had didn't a deserve stroke, a second of silence. Who clearly is very damaged. <laughs> and that's, needs okay, that's, needs needs some me. help. That might be fair. Okay. We had a split second. I talk to you, you some rest, okay. that long, just you know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Relative amount. Okay. Hi everybody. I don't remember any of the voices. Well, all you gotta the start same. remembering them. Kohosh was Wolves, I swear to all that's holy if they get in my inventory, I'll go out there and clock them in the muzzles myself. I don't know what to do. The village is overrun by wolves and it caught fire. Oh, only my wife was still what's, here. What's with characters in these games having dead wives now? Yes. All the dead wives. All the dead wives. It's dead wife night. We always have some kind of ongoing theme that happens. Like that one episode was like child molestation. This one's just dead wives. Pencil tip. That guy's gonna Professor Oak your mom. <laughs> that comment gave me brain aids. Now everyone's reading it. Yep. I'm talking to you if you've gotten some rest, okay? Okay, I gotta get some rest. I think he looks also he this. Was old, I think, yeah, he was old, yeah. Oh no, they look the exactly nose. the same. Yeah, uh -huh. I say we stay inside. The huntsman will be here soon and he'll handle all the wolves for us. Don't tell Josephine I said that. Probably his wife. You're worried about matter? The boy will be fine. All he does is hide in his house anyway. I got the rabbits safe in their hut, but I'm really worried about Joshua. I haven't seen him at all. Joshua. Or Joshua. Oh no, that is a dog. That's the dog. The dog's there. But they look exactly... Dash spotted the wolves first, but I thought he was barking at Esther's rabbits again. Mrs. Sister, does that compliment your regular aids, or is that just Claude? <laughs> at least you got inside safely. Dash is quite a good dog, god dog for a puppy. So I think the difference between puppies and wolves are heart eyes or glow eyes. Yes. <laughs> are you Morse coding? No, I'm megalovaniaing. There you go. Yeah. I was doing it a little faster. Okay, can I rest? Can I rest? Hello? Am I what just is, going back to you once I've talked to everyone? Yeah. Oh, okay, now yeah. we... Hey, Lenora, how are you feeling? Not as good as I can feel in this situation. Good, take this. Mom's package. I appreciate the thought, but I don't think Mom's groceries are... An axe, girl. You're going to help me clear out those wolves. Her mom wanted an axe. <laughs> Sapling axe. But, but I can hardly chop wood, let alone kill a wolf. How can I possibly do that? We have no choice, Lenora. You and I are the only ones who can protect the village right now. Don't worry, we just have enough time that I can teach you how to use it. Dash! Come! We're gonna- We're kill gonna the kill the dog. doggy?! Alright, Lenora, I'm going to run through how to hunt quickly with you because we don't have a lot of time. Oh, and don't worry about hunting Dash. He'll be fine. He's a tough pup. We're Hit gonna him with axe an axe! Dog. Hit him with a fucking axe! One last thing. If you don't follow my orders exactly, we will be stuck here for a very, very long time. Just focus on what I say. This is your hunting ground. The area immediately around you and your prey. Dash over here is the prey. You over there are the hunter. Before any hunt, a hunter's must be familiar with her axe. Get a feel for yours. Try to give Dash a wallop. She's hunt on attack. Oh, so it is literally off. Good, good. Because it's got the timer that shows when you can attack. Mm -hmm. and it's got attacks and specials. Okay. But do you know what makes a good huntress a great one? Knowing her prey. If you know what to expect from prey, your hunts will be much easier. Next, I want you to scout Dash for information about him. Open Ventus, your specials isn't menu that and choose the same scout. dog art as something else you've played? It could be similar to off. I mean, yeah, it looks like an off... Out. Off thing, which I think is the point. I feel like I'm up with a heart made of gold and puppy chow. You're catching on very quick. Good job, Lenora. 
You don't have any of the men do it. Just have a little girl had a puppy with an axe. That makes sense. Yeah. As you gain experience hunting, you'll start to learn new and better techniques to end hunts quickly. But for now, it's good. Oh, go over safety during a hunt. Always keep yourself healthy and hydrated for battle. You should always keep your pockets full. He's a tart in a bottle of water. Go ahead and use either from your pockets. Dead waifu night, aka the climax of the St. Adelaide's okay. art. Spoilers! Even though uh, it's like, you know, half a year old. Yeah. But still spoilers. Still spoilers. For everyone who, when I'm finally famous and published, everyone who decided to go back and watch all my streams, and they get to this and they go, I hadn't gotten there yet! Of course. Uh, food will nourish your body and drink your spirit. Use your provisions wisely. Unfortunately, we've run out of time. Uh, I think we'll come back to you soon. A tart will heal all wounds. Kill, Kill the, the dog, dog, smash the, the sun. sun. No! Yes. Uh, for now, let's just steal ourselves and stop this hysteria. The dog is fine. You did hit the dog with an axe. Though. I did hit the dog with an axe. Follow me. Alright, let's go. Some of the fires went out, but it looks like more wolves got in. Hey, Lenore, are you ready to go hunting? It kind of! Why was her face not there that time? Hmm? She didn't have a face profile that time for that line. Or did she? Yeah. Oh, I didn't see it. If the west half of town, you take the east. We can do this. Chin up. Okay. Wolfie. The hunt is on. Hunt. I'm a hunter. It's literally the same off sound effects too. Yeah, well, the, you could you could see the pretty the pretty uh, obvious off Which even hey, in just the art style. That's totally not a bad thing. I no, that is like not. Off. I'm not saying that is a bad thing. Off has a very good art style, having inspiration from it. Oh yeah. Did the wolves start the fires? I I don't know. Okay, let me use uh tart. Oh, I can say whatever I want. I'm save. Dead wolf. Dead wolf. Barf, barf. Okay. Scope out the wolf. Usually these moves don't actually meet. So. Yeah, because it's... I just wanted to see the funny dialogue. Because then I lost. I lost. I just want to see the funny dialogue. No, because I'm gonna die! And have to use my healing items. Saved it just before the wolf got to me. Ventus, wolf didn't start the fire. It was oh, always burning, burning. Oh, since two the wolf's been learning. I need there's it. There's two. Oh, hey, more people. No, no, go back. Could you say this game is a knock-off? <laughs> this isn't like off at all. It's obviously the predecessor to Bloodborne. Clearly. Andy Vexim, you might have called it. Got him. Got him. I'm glad I got two for that, because... Looks like that's the last of them. I'll gather everyone up at the well, then. Good we job, Lenora. We killed three wolves in the time it took her to kill one. Yes. We're gods. Gods we are of wolf murder. Gods of wolf murder. Oh my goodness, Lenora. Josephine told me everything. I'm so glad you're all right. And the dog. Look at this sweet little doggy. Dancing on the corpses of the wolves. <laughs> da, 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 He's ska da, da, dancing. Da, da, da. What is ska dancing? I don't know. I don't know <laughs> you've how been, ska you've been, like, you've been, You've been obsessed with ska the last day and a half. <laughs> Not the actual music, just as a point mentioning of reference. It. Just mentioning it. Because <laughs> mm -hmm. it just sounds funny. Yes, that is fair. It does sound funny. Uh, she did really well, Patience. Sorry I had to bring your daughter into all of this. Josie, I swear if this was any other time, I would have slapped you myself. You're both lucky you're alive. It it actually wasn't too bad. I actually like killing things. Uh... Ahem. Well, let's see if the story gets more interesting, because... Off... That's... The thing about off. I mean, the battle system is fine, but it's the story that's that's great. Mm -hmm. So we'll see if this one picks up. We're all glad that our courageous ladies survived such an ordeal, most assuredly. But we have a problem. Our village is a wreck, and I feel we won't be able to handle another attack from the wolves. 
That reminds me, oh goodness, Lenora, honey, what about Grandma? She's out in Buttonbush Woods all by herself. Lenora and I can go check on her. Don't worry, Patience, I'll keep her safe. She's going to die within five minutes. The, the woman's, your mom's name is Patience? I have, yeah. Because it's capital P. That is a wonderful idea, Josephine. And after you catch up with our elderly friend, you should go fetch the huntsman. Oh. I love how your voice is literally just Tim Curry's version of Count Olaf. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Uh, or at least one of his disguises. I don't think that's his bass voice, but one of his disguises maybe. uses literally that voice. Huh. Also, Josephine is the huntress lady. Oh, So yes. he said don't tell her he's waiting for the boy because she's a girl. Hate you, baby. God damn it. Tell him about your plight. Surely he'll be able to find a solution to this problem of France. Oh no, it's not Count Olaf. It's who is it? There's one character that Tim Curry voices that sounds exactly like that voice. It's not Count Olaf. Who the fuck is it? Or I can't remember. We'll have to listen. James. To James, tell us. James, why aren't you here? God damn it, James. Ugh, that fool. Why do we need him? I feel like the question marks are me. I feel, like the are, yes. I feel like they are, yes. I feel like they are, yes. Josie, you know the Baron's right about this. The whole village is almost raised to the ground. I agree with Lulubel and the Baron. We could use this his help, at least. Help! Like that bumbling man could ever get his priorities straight for one moment. I say we side with Stonecrop. We don't need him. Thanks, Theodosia. Theodosia? 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 Yes. Uh, We're the only one making sense right now. Theodosia. Benjamin, I don't see why you can't just trust me to keep us John safe Hummel like you used to. Poe, question mark? Is it Poe? I don't think it's Poe. Your parents died in the tragic <laughs> fire. Call, <laughs> call, no. etc. No, it's not Poe. No. The huntsman is such a bore anyway. Josephine. It doesn't help that there's a character named Josephine. <laughs> You're so unfortunate. Oh, is there? Yeah. <laughs> Fine, fine, we'll go get that hopeless sod. But I won't be happy about it. Lenora, once you get your bearings, meet me at the east edge of the square, okay? You have a PM for- I understand, yes. I was not going to check it until after I, the stream. Yeah, but I feel but like you would have PM'd you. Now I have to. Thank you! Thank you, Ventus. <laughs> Thank you, Ventus. Nigel Thornberry. Thank you. There's also a character in Series of Fortune Events. Smashing! There's also a character in Series of Fortune Events that he does voice exactly like that, but yes. It was yes. a perfect moment, guys, because she pulls it up and immediately it's just this big head of just Nigel, N Nigel Thornberry. Thornberry. Fantastic. Fantastic. Thank you. Right. Sure thing, Miss Stonecrop. Maybe the question marks wasn't he talking. I don't know. How There's a I... glowing trash can. I, how do I get out of the town Go square? Down. I can't. Oh, there we go. Trash can. Tree trunk. Oh, it's a tree. Like a tree. Okay, where am I supposed to be? Over tree here? Trunk. Smashing! Smashing! That's a lot of dead work. That dog is just so happy to be among his dead brethren. Yeah. <laughs> dead <laughs> bodies. They're all dead. They're all dead. They're all dead. Are you ready to leave yet? We're in for a long trip. There's no coming back until tomorrow morning. No! No, I would say no, save first. That's fair. Do the dally come to you when you're ready. I go. Yes, I think I'm ready to leave. Good, let's get going then. I can not burp. Or hiccup. let them walk for a minute. Miss Stonecrop, why don't you like the Huntsman? I might sound childish, but I just don't. Ever since he came here, I've never liked him. I used to be able to defend the village, and this Why are there water idiot. bottles inside of trees? Yes. You steal my thing, I steal yours. Ever since I was gonna anything. say sure. Same connotation. Uh, well, did you do something bad to you or anything like that? I don't know if he's ever done a bad thing in his life, to be honest. He's just so perfect. He's perfect with his perfect hair, yeah, his, his perfect, perfect eyes, eyes his, his perfect, perfect body. body. And his perfect... Axe. Oh. <laughs> oh. 
<laughs> Though I can't help but feel that he's capable of it. Every time I look in his eyes, something just the doesn't space right communist from Command and Conquer is that the Tim Curry role? That's you mean? also th no. It is specifically <laughs> someone from Series of Unfortunate Events. But yes, that is another great Tim Curry role. Tim Curry is just the best. He's just the best. Everyone in Pokeweed seems to like him, but maybe. <sighs> Pokeweed. I don't want to get back. He's dead. There are more coming! They're oh. even bigger than before! Damn it! Nora, I need to stay and protect the village. You have to go on. I'll be fine. No, you Yeah, are there's only dead. more up ahead. It's fine. Miss Downcrop! I'm guessing that the huntsman is a werewolf. Yeah. Probably. Racist. Don't worry about me. Get to your grandmother's house. What? Now! They're on two legs. They're on two legs. They're the big boys. Oh, oh I was just gonna save, save anyway. Right. Oh, now it's. Oh, now it's. <sighs> what is that? Well, I guess She's I'm not dead. going back. There's wolves. Did they get to? No, I need to get to Grandma's house. I can't hunt with this crummy axe. Oh boy. Run. Run. Also, they totally killed her. Yeah, they did. She's dead. Okay, I think they're. He's gone. not a werewolf. He's something much, much worse. Oh, <gasps> oh God, they're coming. Okay, get in the grandma. house. Grandma. Grandma! You have to be grandma. Lenora, is that you? Grandma, never speak. <laughs> Please never speak. What's ever the again? matter, dear? Grandma, are you alright? A pack of wolves just attacked the village. He's a Y wolf. <laughs> Goodness, child, I'm fine. Well, you look terribly exhausted. My glasses are upside down. <laughs> I can't see you. I'm me. so disoriented. <laughs> you should rest a while, my dear. Man, people keep telling us to rest. Do we just have these massive bags under our eyes or Go something? Go the fuck to sleep. You look awful. <laughs> Better away. Ventus, Ventus messaging me. Hedgehog, Hedgehog, get some sleep. You look terrible in that last Patreon line across video. <laughs> Thanks, Alex, Ventus. I don't trust that. Open the jacket. <laughs> I am not taking off any of my grandmother's Take clothing. Take off grandma's clothes. All right, dear. If you enjoy... <laughs> Watch <don't>. more from <laughs> your weekend. <laughs> oh, God. The girl reminds me of Little Red Riding Hood. I, I think that's, I, that's the point. I think that's the point. No, she has a pink hood. That's the point. Well, I mean, actually, it's now she now. has an orange hood. A Wolves blood are... orange. Yes. Wolves attacked the village just hours ago, and I'm afraid that they overwhelmed Miss Stonecrop. They Is killed Grandma her. Is evil? She looks evil. No, she, I mean, she does look evil. She has upside-down glasses. I don't think she's supposed to be evil. She has upside-down glasses. That's the tr the mark of a victim. Anyone who has upside-down glasses is clearly evil. I must go to the Huntsman. He's the only one who can help us now. I am the henchman. <laughs> oh. Ma. Ma. Wolves always were a problem with the hollow, but I've never heard of them attacking the village so directly yeah. like this. Andy Vexia just mentioned there are literally wolves right outside her door. Yeah. <laughs> dish, 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 dish. What's that, dear? Your friends? I'd write them in on no! my cookies. <laughs> Something must be making them act so strangely, don't you think? Certainly not normal. In any case, I agree that finding a strong, brave hunter Manly is hunter. the only choice we have, but is it really safe for you to go it alone? No, it's not. Take this. It's dangerous to go alone. I have nothing to give you. <laughs> well, Miss Stonecrop taught me how to hunt. I'm no huntress, but I've already killed three of them today. There are even bigger ones outside, though, and the axe I have right now is too weak to do the job. You need a stronger axe, you say? Well, I just happen yeah, to have one right here in my shirt. Well, you're in luck, my dear. I have a nice, sturdy firewood axe you may borrow. If it can split wood, it can split wolf skulls. <laughs> you're so grandma, funny, you're Grandma. you're scaring me. You're so funny and charming. Oh, let me go fetch it right now. No! Quick. There's wolves! <laughs> It's right outside. <laughs> Dies. Somehow she got it. I think it's in the other room. Oh. Cutting the 
I figured it would be outside for the I figured it would too, but you know, fuck if I know. Good thing your old grandma's got a shotgun. Let me add him trice replaced hips. Don't fail me now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Screw that axe. I've got me old AK-47 over here in the corner. Your, your grandfather left me this. <laughs> Let's kill some wolves. <laughs> Here we are, darling. You'll better you make better use of this than your old grandma. But you don't keep an axe next to your bed? No, Ventus, that's only you. I Grandma's an totally an axe murderer. Yeah, yeah. Yes. We also baked some pastries you could take with you. Make sure to keep yourself nourished. I with won't pastries. This was ye olden times. It's buttermilk. It's all good. It's healthy. It's it's sure. It's a whole bottle of water. Thank you, Grandma. I'll return as soon as I'm able. Leroy would really like Grandma. Just gave you a bunch of water. Yes, she did. I love a movie about a bad fucking in a fighting wars. Yes. Yes. I keep no less than two machetes <laughs> now. I've got an M32 rotary grenade launcher. I keep four pump shotguns next to my bed. <laughs> Grandma, hold this silver if you use in your world. <laughs> <laughs> Read your lines. Remember, wolves are fearsome, cunning creatures. Even if they are rabid, they deserve our respect. See, I do. When you kill them, you have to decapitate them and fuck the corpse. Oh! It shows honor! <laughs> See, I do love sometimes having the face cams on when we do voice acting stuff because then people can see how stupid expressions we make when we're trying to do voices. People always ask for voice acting tips. That's one. You make stupid faces make when you do voices. Make stupid faces. Like, what do I do, Grandma? This is what it sounds like. But then I can do something like this if I look like a pedophile. <laughs> I can't do a little girl voice unless I'm doing this with my face. Unless she's Grandma, jittering. I have to jitter like this. Um, all right, sweet. She's walking. She collapses. She just collapses on the floor. Oh God, the heart! He's <laughs> in the fire. What you doing? What are you, you doing, Grandma? Oh, I can. Oh, okay. I, I thought that yeah. was that was part of the cutscene. No, I, I, I didn't know. I figured you didn't know, so I figured I just let. Thank it you. Sit. Yes, I figured it was part of the cutscene. Your mother's always worrying about me. I think she keeps forgetting that the strength of survival is woven in our blood. Fucking. You know, I'll be wasting away oh God. in my deathbed before I let some trite little wolf bring me down. No, oh, okay, uh -huh. we're leaving now. We're leaving now. Oh, there they are. Oh, time to murder some wolves. Hi. You big boy. Okay, that does a little more damage. But he also does more damage. I love the animation for that. <laughs> It's just a violent, shaking wolf skull. Or it's kind of bad. Violent wolf skull. Hurts pretty bad. Ooh, that does hurt pretty bad. Buttermilk. I got bum milk pie. Grandma used to eat cereal out of a wolf skull when I was your age. <laughs> oh! Grandma! A wolf skull that I hunted down and killed in cold blood. Oh. Then of course I decapitated the head fuck the corpse. Oh! Wolves. Okay. Where's the hits all the other? Oh, he's not dead yet. That's unfortunate. Now he's dead, that's fine. Now he's dead too. Good thing your grandma's the Terminator. Lost to the beast, <laughs> puppy. Oh. Yeah, the wolves are all suddenly less interested. They're sort of paroling. They just forgot you were in there. Yeah, uh-huh. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Oh, shit. I hate how they use hurts pretty bad. What does that mean? What does that mean? Hurts pretty bad. 
Maniacal Matro. Hello. Welcome. Oh. Hello. Okay. I'm so weak right now. I have to heal between every battle. Yeah. <laughs> That's probably why they're all dropping stuff. Probably. Because they assume that you... Recovers 10 PP. PP up. I am going through a lot of shit. I'm gonna pass this. Norm, it's not like you're leveling up. Here we go. Here we go. I wanted to get that first. The hunt is on. A head splitting axe chop. Ooh, that did a lot. Nice. There he goes. He's dead. <laughs> I bet it means it hurts pretty bad. Probably. What's over here now? Chokeberry thicket. <laughs> Fight me! Fight me! Fight me! I joined the army when I was in my 40s, and oh boy, did your granddaddy know how to use a shovel! Oh! We got oh yeah, that is true. Guys. Sitting Pyro pointed it out, you're holding your axe properly now. You're not like oh, struggling yeah. mm -hmm. the carrier. The Lost Boy, hello, welcome. Oh, it's red. Red, oh. Music chair. That's cool. I like how the music changes is... when you cross over. Oh, this is going to start getting dark now, isn't it? I hope. Chokeberry thicket. I want just the black forest. And yes. It's just awfully, like, ecstatic. I love how they'll just wait for you. Yeah, they'll, they'll just... You want to hear you looking in there, dude? Okay. Oh, it's all red now. Yeah, and then everything changes based on where you are. That's a good design. Good design See, choice. that that attack, though, does just as much damage, but for way less PP. It just hits all enemies. Which is bizarre, because usually those the cost more. Does the head splitter? It, say, it does, yeah, because the head splitter is like 10 PP, you need 10 PP to hit it. But that one is only four, and it hits all the enemies for the same amount of damage. I feel like something a little awry there. I got some buttermilk though, it's fine. Don't worry about it, it's fine. I gotta start uh -huh, using- PP. I gotta start using less- Thank you, Brenda. I'm gonna have to start using less specials and more attacks though. Uh, I have a lot of healing items, but or I don't have- just start avoiding wolves. No, I, get, I need the experience. Are you getting experience? I think so. You're not leveling up or anything. I've, You've killed a lot of wolves. You're still level I one. I have. I No, I'm level two now because I used to have only like no, 10. No, go up to press start. Level oh. One. I got more HP though. I didn't start out with 20 and 25. When I had, did you get more HP? I don't know. And pro I think when the when I maybe got into the woods. Maybe when you got the axe? Yeah, the I think axe, when I got the maybe. new axe. But that, that has nothing to do with you actually killing wolves. No, that's fair. I just feel like we're go we're blowing through supplies. And yeah, it's not so let us. Worth it. Oh shit! I was gonna try to avoid that wolf. Wolf is straight up walking on ten legs. Now I think werewolves might be possible. Yeah, probably. <laughs> uh, uh, nope, I'm good. Cause I have lots of these. The health items. Yeah. Yeah, no, you have a lot of health items, just not a lot of. PP items. Okay. So I guess you could just do basic attacks if you get caught, but yeah. I mean... Mm -hmm. North, North the Huntsman's Cabin, Blood Root Forest. Oh, up. Well, yeah, obviously, but I just wanted to see if I can go past there. The entrance to Blood Root Forest is just past this fence, but I'm quite sure the Huntsman is in his cabin. Blood Root is very dangerous. The wolves that live there are much too strong for me to hunt anyway. He's gonna get spicy. Spicy boy axe. Huntsman, are you in? It's the Nora Calamint! Calamint. Calamint. Not home, his door's unlocked. He's fucking dead. Maybe he fell asleep while sleeping. Can wait, the village needs help now. Respect that dragon isn't giggling every time she he says pee pee. 
Because everyone He's in the matured. chat's doing it for He's me. matured. Well, I'm absolutely He's matured. on the inside. But you're not insisting on doing it on the outside as well. Because people in the chat are. Like Brett Davis, who says, ha ha pee pee. Let me believe. No. Let me believe. He's okay. dead. He's fucking dead. Oh no, is he really no, not he's home? Just gone. He's just not home. What am I going to do now? I'm going to have to do it alone. Well, I ought to look around in here before I leave. His cabin might have, must have some provisions I can borrow for the trip home. Congratulations. Don't congratulate me, it's false. <laughs> Incorrect information. False hope. This meal is still warm and untouched. Where could the huntsman have gone? Stuff. Well, yeah, obviously you wouldn't team up with the huntsman because you, you're the main character who has yeah. to become a huntress. Of course. Wolves are just angry puppies. Uncongratulations, then. Use for the Thank axe Grandma gave me. All right, now I got the lumberjack axe. I just took his axe. Yeah. The one said the door was locked too. It probably is your pantry. In any I case. thought that was a bookshelf. Like when you were, when you walked up to it. I'm like bookshelf, and I was like, that's a door. That is a door. Oh no! That wolf looks huge, and I can bet that there's more out there. Where are they all coming from? I might be able to handle a few of them, but things don't look good at all. I need to check on Grandma before I reach the village. Bar. Oh, he's a big boy. Where's the axe that you're holding? Oh, it's behind it's your behind head. It's behind my head. Yeah, look, you got 25 health now. Yep, so whenever you get an axe... No, no. I got new moves, yeah. All pretty hard. This one's... Where's the jack jack jack? Oh! That is as much as your basic yeah, attack. Yeah, that is as much as my basic attack, yeah. But now I'm all out of PP. Yeah. That's the one all thing, if, if I have to make a, I mean, there's a couple things I'm sort of waiting towards the end to, to start stating them. Mm -hmm, yeah. Uh, I would say that the moves are very oddly balanced. They are. I will definitely say yeah. Well, if I'm not getting any experience from these, I'm going to avoid them if yeah. I can. Because the game even said at the beginning it might be best to dodge certain ones. But, scamper. Um, scamper, scamper. I have a suggestion. Move your village. Don't, don't go out alone and fight werewolves. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh, it is just the same song, but slowing down. Yes. Oh. But, um... Yeah, I would say that would be my thing, is the moves are very oddly balanced. Like, yes. a lot of the times, the damage isn't worth the EP <laughs> that you're <laughs> wasting. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's like, why use the yeah. Mm -hmm. Come on, I've returned. Back so soon. Were you able to find the huntsman, dear? He's dead. No, Grandma, he's fucking dead. Uh, he wasn't in his cabin. I haven't the slightest idea where he could be. Well, I don't have time to wait for him to save us. There are ferocious wolves out there. The village is lost if I don't leave right away. Curious as this may be, you'll be wolfed out if I let you leave like this. Rest a while, Lenora. Go to sleep. You look Go exhausted, to bed. child. You look like you haven't slept in ages. I, I just, just slept, slept here two last minutes ago. <laughs> Go to bed. Go to bed, you fuck. <laughs> Literally, me to you. Go to bed. I'm not letting you leave like you this. You look Go to like bed. shit. <laughs> I do anyway. All right then. Time for you to leave, dear. Get the fuck out. Yes, I'm afraid so. I hope I can do this. Lenora, you look my age. Go to bed. <gasps> Oof. Lenora, I look young compared to you. <laughs> what the fuck to sleep? She doesn't have any wrinkles. Yeah. Be cautious and cunning, Lenora. Fearsome as your wolves may be, they're as just as lost as we She's are. She's a fucking wolf. You keep saying how they respect. Mm -hmm. She's clearly the leader of the wolf. Yes. By the way, take some extra provisions with you. Ah. Take a breather, kid. Thank Killing you, werewolves all day. Alright, I guess we're heading back to the village in that case. Yep. All the way back. All the way back. Plot twist. Oh, there's She's the not huntsman. a wolf. Huntsman. Oh. Oh. <laughs> now I just have to give him a really bad voice. No! Give him a nice voice. Well, look who we have here. No! Hello, little Anora. No, give him a nice voice. Please, I beg of you. 
I said my line. I'm not moving until you give him a nice voice. <laughs> no. Give him a nice voice. I'll let the chat decide. Please, I am going to do two voices for you, chat. One or number two. Number one. Well, look who we have here. Hello, little Lenora. Or two. Well, look who we have here. Neither of those are sexy. Hello, little Lenora. Neither of those are sexy. Well, those are the two I'm choosing. anti vexium says one. Who in the style of Leslie Nielsen? Miley's with two. says two. One to we one. have one to one. Please two. do two. Please okay, that's two, two for two. Two, two, two go, go with McCree. McCree. Thank you, everyone. That's the preferable voice, at least. We have two for two. We have three for two, technically, because Dribble voted twice. No. <laughs> Dribble does not get two votes. McCree. Okay, that's three for McCree. I'm shaking. How can Hedgehog just like the cowboy voice? Come no, I'm kidding. I like the cowboy voice very much. Yeah, everyone's saying two. two. All right, cool. Well, I flipped them around. No, you well, didn't. No, you me. didn't. You said one and you said two. I said my line. No, Please you did not. No, you did not. I did. Please go to the next one. You, you cheated chat. How could you do this? <gasps> Visiting Thank your you. grandmother, were you? What a good girl you are. You look creepy, but sexy. <laughs> yes. Dragon can vote. That's true. It's Except still, it it's, it's one count of one battle. Dragon's voices if, sound similar to Will Ryan from DA Games. Yeah, kind of. Because if you can vote, that means I can vote. So you're just outvoted anyway. You can't vote, no. Yes, I can. No. If you can vote, I can. No, that's not going to work. Huntsman, I was looking all over the force for you. Where <laughs> have you gone? I demand a recount. That's one vote from everyone. Recount. <laughs> that's still one vote, vote for from everyone. everyone. Recount. I approve of Dragon's first choice. Women voting. What? what? Wow. Wow. Well, I was out doing what I do best, my girl. What's gotten you in such a fuss? Stung by a wasp again? Huntsman, Pokeweed Hollow has been overrun by wolves. You need to come with me right away. We have to get... Uh, it is it. Gerbil says, I hate that I know that reference. Spooky godmother. The hollow's overrun by wolves, is it? Well, you and I will have to rectify that, won't we? Oh, yes. Come along, then. Oh, we have we much will. to do. Wait, where are we going? Back to my cabin, of course. If In only, bed. if only Galaxy Potato was still here, we could fight over who gets him now. Bad. Trust me, little Calamint. This wolf problem won't be solved by rushing to the village like a couple of silly now. Let's get going now. We won't get anything done dawdling around in the woods. Yep, the hedge is thirsty for skinny huntsman boy. Yeah, I, that's why I wanted to do a bad voice. Because he is a skinny huntsman boy. I'm predictable as fuck. The moment I saw a sprite on the screen. Yep. yep. No, no, don't go to the creepy man's cabin alone. <laughs> We're going to go to the creepy man's cabin. Well, now that we're in my cabin, I can finally undisguise. Oh, my boy! No! <laughs> Please remind me why we're here instead of the village. Dear little, oh, dear little Lenora, I've already told you why. Simply killing the ones in the village won't stop this. Then how do we stop the attacks? <laughs> Depends on the workshop. Two. Two. <laughs> Wolves may be pack hunters, but they always have a leader. I've run into this pack's big bad alpha wolf. Or he's an old nemesis of mine, but looks like his time has come, doesn't it? I suppose so. As long as we can do it quickly, there's really there there really isn't much time left. We? Oh no, little Lenora, I'm going it alone. I don't know why I brought you back to my cabin. Yeah. Then I would have. You're here you to could, wait for me when I come back. You, no, but he could have went to fight the Alpha alone and sent her back to defend the village. He could have. See. I do not think ahead of what I'm doing. See, I found that when I well, get my... I can come back and you'll be there too and you can work I there. find... Fuck in the bedroom. I was going to be funny with it, but you just went all out of it. I was going to say, I find when I give myself a little reward after my hard work, it helps me do the work faster. So you're just going to stay here. We're going to fuck in the bedroom.
nonsense. You'll be killed the moment you step outside. Safer to stay here in the cabin. Huntsman, I've hunted whole packs of wolves by now. I can handle myself. Well, that may be. I wouldn't want to put you in any danger any longer. You'd be irresponsible. Mother would have my head. In her mouth. Penis joke. <laughs> Here. You can have my spare hunting axe. It'll make you feel safe. Huntsman's axe. We have the lumberjack axe. Huntsman right. axe. Also, should a stray wolf break in, here's a little trick to end its life quickly. He's crying. Not crying. Oh, but there were tears. <laughs> here's a little trick to end. <laughs> the huntsman sounds like Matthew Mercer. Now he's gonna be crying. Thank you. <laughs> no. For that. Oh, behead the wolf. I appreciate everything you've done for me, but I can't help but feel like I need to go with you. <laughs> I know. I know, little Calvin, I know. <laughs> it's just so stressful. Uh, Are you okay? Are you okay? It's just so stressful. Do you, need a, do you need a hug? It's okay. Thank you. You're okay. You took my leg, Lenora. The great white whale that spawns <laughs> from nowhere. That's why I had this pig leg. Starting to hit voice one now. Yes. <laughs> yes. I now, read his dialogue, but in every sentence with the last word, that is a western. I know, little Calumet, this is a stressful time for you, for everyone. But don't you worry your pretty little head off. I'll solve all this once and for all. Except when I go die, so that you can become the hero. Yeah. I have some treats to hold you over for the night. You'll be back by morning with a brand new wolf pelt cloak. Nice. Ew, he gave you his apple butter pasty? He did. Well, I'm gonna give you a mighty fine pasty. Because it didn't say pastry. You can stick it in your mouth. Oh, I do love sweets. Oh, it's sweet. Salty. All right. <laughs> right then, I'm off. Try to get some rest. You've had a long day. Little Literally, little they just got you to like, to sleep. Hey, but you must rest. I literally just, just slept, slept at my grandma's house. I ago. walked out of the door. We're a minor? Yes. Yes, that's the joke. Highly disturbing. Yes. Don, yes. I still feel like I need to go after him. For some reason, staying behind doesn't feel safe to me at all. Should I stay or should I should go? Should I stay or should I go? Ba -da 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 -da. Stay. S stay. Because <laughs> he'll die. Chat? What does chat think? I'm just curious what'll happen if you stay. Because clearly they want you to go. Oh, of course, yeah. And be the hero. Mm -hmm. But I just... Andy Vexim says stay. Of course okay. you say stay. You and Andy Vexim got that wavelength. We're, we're go? on. Go? Okay, one for stay, one for go. Gog. We do have a save. So we do have a save. I'm assuming stay will end the game or something. Probably. Or, or yeah. it'll... He'll die and it'll force us to go out. Yes. Mm-hmm. Um... Gog. Do we, dog? Do we want to stay? Say stay then? Just I kind of do. I wanna okay, see what happens, we'll go. We'll the one stay thing they don't want you to do. Well, I guess I should stay. I don't know if it's the best choice, but oh well. He is the huntsman after all. I think I deserve some rest. <sighs> Wolves! They broke in! No, no! Huntsman! Huntsman! Oh, she's oh. You do die. Oh, she's fucking dead. I didn't think it would kill you. I just figured it would end the game. Oh, she's, she's, oh. Oh, shit. Oh, this game is going to get dark in a second, isn't it? Oh, well, dragging. shit. <laughs> it's involved by the wolves. Hudson returned from hunting the alpha wolf only to find her mangled corpse been in the forest. Upon delivering the news of Lenora's passing to her mother, he decided to settle in the village permanently, taking over as the hunter of polka weed. The Hudson protected the village as valiantly as he could, but the attacks became numerous for one man to handle. He died. He fucking died. Well, One man, day. you the huntsman is gone. One day the huntsman disappeared from the village entirely. The villagers wanted to come by wolves himself. Without Lenora or the huntsman, the suffer wolf attacks and kills enough. Pokeweed Hollow was wiped out entirely and remained forgotten forever. Wow, we, by not going, we killed ourselves, the huntsman, and town. We abandoned everything. We abandoned everything. 
Okay, now we have to read through all this again. Okay, yeah. But hey, I'm glad we did it. It's fine, it won't be that long. I'm just speed running. Speed running strats. Speed running. See, what you can do is... Speed running strats. Just keep clicking. Okay. My desk is shaking because I'm pressing so hard. Okay, here we go. I love how the second she says I'll stay, she gets mauled. All right, we're gonna I go. think I'll stay. Yeah. yeah. Even if she leaves, yeah. she'd die. Yeah. Yeah. I think I should go. I should go! I'm going! There are too many wolves out there for one person to handle. Experience hunter or not. I mean, according to the other ending, he did kill the alpha wolf by himself. I mean. It said after he returned from killing the alpha yeah. wolf, so he was fine. No, 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 I mean... <laughs> You would, you'd get mauled either way. No, no, I'm just, I'm, outside. I'm saying for what she said. She's like, I need to help him. Like, Spirit Hunter or no? Yeah, no, he, he, he was fine. fine. He was fine. It's as if they were waiting outside and then jumping the second she says, stay. Yes. Hello? Ah, I was never gonna avoid that hey, one. Hey, you though. can try the new technique that I he taught you. I can. Oh, I've got 50 now. Okay. With the wolf. Oh! It is a one shot. That is a one shot. But it uses a lot of PP. Yeah, it uses a lot of PP. Okay, I'm getting more PP. What it probably is, is they know that at this point you're just going to be dodging wolves. So they're like, if you get into an encounter, you can yeah. just use up PP to just kill it. No, I didn't want to turn back. I want. Oh. Like okay. that. Like that. Boom. Crush. So you can use it twice for full PP. Yes. Before I need to. Let's save it. I like to use my smaller ones. Mm -hmm. Oh. Purple. Purple. I thought it was going to be silent. I did too. There's no, um. Yes. Full eyed werewolf. Oh. I don't. Oh, you're, yeah, and you're purple now. Yep. Oh, there's two ways I can go. Okay. Just glad this game doesn't use generic RPG sound. That's okay, fair. Okay, that I mean, it happen. does use some of the off ones. But... It does use some of the off ones, which in themselves, I believe, were generic RPG yeah. maker sound effects. Bye. That was just there first. It's yeah. Just like... uh -huh. Now he's dead. They do follow you. Yeah, they do. When you're, if you're within a radius, they'll move to. And I'm assuming the radius gets. Probably. That it's one. harder and harder. Oh no, it's Oh, now... there is a black forest. Oh, it's nice. now black. Bog something. Bone set crag or something? Bone set crag. Sarsaparilla. Sarsaparilla. Want some clay now? There's just... They're just everywhere. I'm just dodging all of them. Farewell, wolves. See, I so one thing I'll point out is I like the transition in the levels. Yes. The only thing that I'm finding unfortunate is that the mobs look the, the same. same. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like it's just the same wolf, slightly different colored eye. Firewolf which, den. I'm assuming the alpha wolf will have a special oh yeah thing, but like just in each area, I feel like. And of course, I'm asking, hey, in each area, I have a different enemy. And I don't care if it's the same enemy AI-wise, mm -hmm. but just having a different look would... He oh! did murder the thing. The hunter's dead. Oh, oh no, he's no. dead. It, it ate the huntsman. I thought he cut it open. I can't like, do this. So you going got him killed. Ah. Because he was fine. Yeah. We're assholes. Wow. When... We're assholes. I can't do this. What am I going to... 
How can I? Because look, I thought he died. I mean, I thought that it, he killed it. You know yeah, what I mean? uh huh. No, I've come too far. There's no turning back. But yeah, of course, you have to get him killed to become the hunter. To yes. Save the I move it. Bye. I'm to. Oh, Jesus Christ. That's a cool. That is a real. This the thing is the person who's designing them is really good. Like I wish that they. Oh, oh, it's not I wish I could see more of what they. Oh, and I wasted that PP now too. You can't behead it. No, I can't. I figured you could, and I don't know why you well, tried. Well, I wanted but... to try. I mean, yeah, I guess, but. You Jesus didn't have a Christ! Lot of I keep PP. missing. Can I not hit it? Okay, I can. But. It probably has a much more, like a much higher dodge rate. I didn't see that. I was too busy clicking. Yeah. Uh, no, I gotta go into the pockets. Gotta... That's pee pee. Yeah, I know. Okay. I don't know what it's doing. Yeah, right? It's just doing things. I love how he attacks by spitting giant skulls at you. Yeah. I just need to start hitting it. And then just heal when I need. I feel like your things have the ability to miss, though, versus your specials. They do, but he has the ability to miss, too. And then now I'm just gonna heal I up. guess, but yeah, I was gonna say, but he's doing more damage to you when he doesn't miss. Oh, that was peak shit. Okay, I got really lucky there. Buttermilk pie slice? That's 10. That's 15. Yeah, it's gotta be the L. Now I can use it. Wolf's almost dead. Nothing. I can't help to feel maybe this isn't right. But I really finished it off. It killed the huntsman. Its pack is terrorizing my home, yet. I just got here, but I required no context for why a little girl is smacking down with a giant wolf. Yes. Yes. Behead yes. the wolf or spare the wolf. Oh, now it's giving us this choice. We're gonna have to do this fight again now. Chat? Yeah, I have my opinion, but I wanna hear what chat has to say about it. Let's see what chat has to say. Kill it! Says John Hummel. We have one vote for kill. Man, I remember the days when I used to get like 10,000 comments immediately. Until spare, spare. Spare, friendship, spare. Behead it, or it comes back and kills you later. Two, two. Kill that thing. Three. three. Rescue the little sister. There's no little sister. That's not an option. I, I was gonna say, I don't remember that, but okay. To the abyss with it. That's four. Four kill. Seems we have a lot of seems kills. Seems we have a lot of kills. All right. We're gonna kill it. Behead it. Yes, it's just a wild animal after all. It's terrorizing my village and eating the huntsman. I must kill it. I need to use that finishing blow and put it out of its misery. Okay. So you need to use behead. Now I need to use behead, yeah. So I need more. You can't. You gotta I need more, more PP. I was gonna say, I like how it has to make sure that you have that, because otherwise, if you just used all your PP things and didn't have behead the wolf. Uh huh. <laughs> well, to be fair, it's given you enough that you probably yeah, would exactly. not run out. That's what I mean. It was successful. Lenora stood above the alpha wolf's corpse, her axe dripping with blood. The hunt had been much easier than she thought it would be. But then again, she was lucky that the beast had been wounded greatly by the late, brave huntsman. She returned to the village with the wolf's head in her hands. The villagers were overcome with joy at her triumph and sadness at the, the huntsman's passing. The wolf was passing. so much bigger than that, but okay. Yes, it was. <laughs> the wolf's head was mounted in the baron's home. Well, I was mounted in her home! She was the one who killed it! Come in decoration as a mantelpiece. With his death, the wolf... What do you mean, her home? That's the baron! That's, that's, what I, that's what I'm saying. Why isn't it in her home? Why is it in his home? Because I want it, you bitch. Oh, fuck you! I'm the brave baron, Barry uh, Bottom. Yeah, uh, butts, Barry butts, butt, 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 butts and butt cheeks. Uh, since the huntsman had died, Lenora became the sole guardian huntress yeah. of Pokeweed Hollow. She took numerous hunting lessons from Miss Stonecrop. Oh, she didn't die! Miss Stonecrop? She didn't die. Oh, she's probably just brutally maimed. Yes. But, like, still alive, barely. Yes. And we're chosen to protect her home. 
But the wolf attacks, though much less frequent, never actually stopped like the huntsman told her they would. After fears, Lenora became too exhausted to fight them off. With their guardian out of commission, the, hunt the villagers had no choice. They abandoned the hollow and began looking for a new place to call home. There is, the, uh, so you have to spare it so that it be, there's peace in the village. Yes. And, yeah. mm -hmm. After they left, the village remained forgotten and abandoned until the force swallowed it whole. Okay. Damn. But yeah, I'm back quite a ways. Oh well. It's not taking me that long to run That's through. True. Better make sure I have a bunch. Ah, shit. Why can't I use that? Oh, I only have 10 PP. Have... We're just gonna use it. He dead. He... I feel like... Highlights comp is just... Saying pee pee over and over again pee -pee, for this stream. Pee -pee, pee -pee, pee -pee, How many pee -pee, times can hedgehogs say pee pee? Yeah, pee pee counter. Pee -pee and it's counter. just all of the pee pees in this yes. game. Yes. You just added like 20. Pee pee. Yes. Yeah, let me make your work harder for you. Pee pee, pee pee, pee pee. Thank you so much. Gotta distance them out a little bit, you know, so you can't just crop that one section and yeah, then a pee pee. Uh -huh. And then maybe, you know, I'll say a little bit more and then throw in a pee pee in there. I'm just gonna crop this whole section regardless. <laughs> yeah, of course. Because I'm lazy. Nice, I got all the PP items this time. <laughs> Andrew says PP. Thank you. Love her little, her little scoot. Scoot, yeah. Little scoot. I hate how they still keep moving even when you're Even items. when you're doing stuff, yeah. I mean, I like how you can sort of time it so that they walk away from you. Like no, you're they not. won't. They won't walk away from you though. They just they keep do. walking towards you. No, they, they walk away from you. They hit you and you're in a thing, they'll take a step away. Oh, do they? It gives you a time to just... Yeah, you're just not waiting for them. Oh, oh look I at the pee-pee in the chat. Look at that Look at pee -pee. a BB from Mr. S look at that. Look at all that. Twice. Yeah, next time you're in that situation, wait wait oh, for no. it to come up to you. Because okay. I've been noticing that it was walking away. But I have to press save all the way back. I want Stasperol. Yeah, just don't waste the... The big ones. I'm... I like the kill ending. I can't read that. I'm busy. Okay. No. Okay, I was going to show it's you there, fine. but it's... Don't need it. I like the kill ending. It's really sad. No matter how Eleanor fights the village, simply doomed because of its proximity to something about that feels appealing to me. You, you and I, my lips are dribble, like to share that feeling of melancholy. I feel. Both enjoy it. Okay. Yep. It ate the huntsman. I can't do this. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I feel like the. I also agree with that because I feel like the endings where everything just gets solved is something that I've never vibed with. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. that's. Not how it works. Like, nothing... There's never a time where all of a sudden just all of your problems are solved. Mm -hmm. Now, you can get most of your problems, but there's always either a residual from the problems, mm -hmm. or there's more left that you can't, you okay, know... So we're not using... Is, is the wolf holding back? What's making him high? It's ferocity. Oh, see, so that's the dialogue we missed. Yep. This yeah, that has well. most damage. Doesn't care when my when my axe cleaves him. I can. Yeah, see, they're really selling the spare him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's why it's called fantasy dragon. No, <laughs> I want wheel wife. Wheel wife. No, I totally get it. I, I'm just saying it's not my thing. I totally get why it's there and why people enjoy it. Who knows that? But I can't help but feel like maybe this isn't right. Did I really finish it off? It had killed the huntsman. You killed him very quickly. My home. Yeah, because I just used the big ones. Yeah. All right, we're gonna spare him. I I can't do it. This creature has hurt me and my village so much, but I can't do it. He's a witch or wolfie. I hope he just eats her. I know, right? Oh, that'd be you. Wolf. 
A big grumble. Well, I suppose. <laughs> unless you... No. All right, chat, we're doing a vote. No. <laughs> I suppose I should thank you for bearing. So, thank you. Oh, he's oh, hot. No, he's hot. Oh, no, he's hot. Wh what? Who are you? Tell me who you are. Oh, he is just a wolf boy. He's just a wolf boy. Oh, He's no. He's a wolf boy. Who am I? I'm alpha of the wolf. If you really can't tell. Not the sharpest fang in the mall, are you, honey? Don't get smart with me, wolf. You know I didn't mean that. Tell me your name. <laughs> My lips are terrible. Ooh, ooh, wolf boy. Names are human construct. However, you... Feel free to cave all. Picked it up. Elias Pop. I think we all know where this is going. Oh, yeah. I've seen an elf hand trying to know where this is going. He's gonna turn back into the wolf. Oh, and yeah, then... fucker. With his giant wolf. I cock. like how he just goes, <sighs> human concepts, names. Anyway, call me Avil. <laughs> <laughs> all right, then, Avil. You killed the huntsman and your pack is attacking my home. Give me one good reason to keep myself from bringing this axe down on your neck. Do Damn. Like well, I have many good reasons. The best reason I can offer is this. I'm not the one responsible for the attack attack. You'll have to find out in the sequel. I don't think you No. Oh, I do apologize for that. You're not responsible, but you're the Alpha. These wolves follow your orders. The Huntsman was incredibly clear about that. I think a human idiom works. Have you ever heard of wolfy clothing? Make a long and arduous quote. It's my brother Kana, I mean Kane, turning my pack around. In sheep's clothes. I don't know. Bastard. Unless, Unless he's a Kane sheep. is what, the huntsman or someone we already know or something like Maybe, that. Maybe, or he's a sheep. He's grandma. Yeah, 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 the wolf. Your brother? Kane and Abel. Bible reference. <laughs> I haven't seen any other wolf like you since this all began. Like I said, didn't yeah, he's clothing. someone we already know. He's yeah. So it sounds like you know him already. The hunter, the hunter for sure. I'd assume so. Yeah. He's a little too. So it sounds like. I think you called yep. him the. Wow. Whoa! Shocking what a, plot twist. What a twist. It's not like there are sprites. Spatial structures look very similar or anything like that. That's not even that. It's just the fact that they, he, of course, because he was not, he was too good of a guy. Mm -hmm. And then it's just like, oh, well, you know, there's a, there's someone among you. And it's just like, yeah, it's, it's you know him as the hunter. Yeah, no. I, yeah, I, I okay, yeah. Mm -hmm. This just went into bad fan fiction. Yeah, yeah. I love it. Huntsman, didn't you just, didn't you kill him just now? You beat me something fierce and he likes to do things like tricky bastard. The wolf he doesn't look like you at all. And he hunts wolves. He wears a wolf's pelt as a cloak, for goodness sake. No, that's just his werewolf skin. He even told me how to behead wolves as cleanly as an executioner's guillotine. That sounds horrifying. Pleasant. Oh no, he's a furry. Oh my god, they were right. <laughs> they, they they said it too. <laughs> they did. Who, who specifically said, hold on. I you can't was, go back up all I the way. I think it was Gerbil. No, it was Gerbil. It was Gerbil who said he was a furry. <laughs> you got it. Congratulations, well done, you called it. You did it. In any case, he is a wolf. See all the rest of his body is Hey, we all have some markings on our faces. The the lines. Yes, the they're crime. not scars. They're... So to you, they may look like scars under his eyes. under his, his eyes? Plot twist. Definitely never saw that coming. A wolf mutiny. Pirate wolves. Pirate wolves. Pirate wolves. Pirate wolves. Pirate wolves. Oh. Oh no. Listen. Till you kill my brother, I will wreck everything. Maybe he's been hunting them. The more he hunts, the more panicked. Come in the forest. Terror. Hiding under the guise of a man for as long as he has this wolf. What? For as long. Hiding under the guise of a man for as long as he has destroys oh, a wolf. Oh, okay. I read that wrong, too. Yes. It's not the... But surely there's a way to reverse it, to cure him? I just can't kill him after all he's done for the village. 
was away, I was a poet. Let him live and kill all the Probably. So now what do we do? Kill me. But he told me how to kill you! Do you really honestly think I can do better than that? No. The best I Good way. This is an enchanted house. Us will things, but sometimes... Well, we've never used this drone. So why did you use it? Do what to it? Wolf never loses his. I thought it said coming. But you, <laughs> me, Hunter, you won't know what to. First hope. Let me show you how to wield it. More than just within you. Cut to black. Lycan's Maw. Like Kayon. Magic axes. You're a wizard, Lenore. <laughs> I'm a what? I'm a what? I'm a hairy wizard. Oh! Because I'm a wolf. Yeah, yeah, uh, I, I, I get oh, it. Oh, my wolves have stolen some supplies from me. It's like, apologize. And. Wildberry Parfaits. And. Sarsaparilla Cream. Then this is it, isn't it? I can do it. Well, wish me luck, I suppose. Luck as I can, Huntress. By the way, Abel, my name isn't Huntress. Lenora. I'm gonna fuck you and chant that name, Lenora. Yeah. Pleasure to meet you, Huntress Lenora. Why are you believing this thing? Because he hot. Oh my god, it's gonna make you walk all the way back to the village, isn't it? Uh, or his cabin. Forest cabin. Which is not that far from the village. It is gonna make me Can I give Lenora a hug? <laughs> Can I give Lenora a hug? Go away and never return. I didn't say it. I'm just reading the chat. You read the chat though, you could have ignored it. No. Unlike you, I don't ignore the chat. I curate. All the wolves are gone though. Literally now just a dead walk. Into you can, but only if you're wearing your fur suit. That's a terrible reason to believe something, Hedgehog. Don't tell her that it got me this far. What? What? It's fine, don't worry about it. What? 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 Wait, you're hot? No. Oh, yeah. But you seem to think thought. so. No, that's what I thought. I didn't think you were hot. Good. You're finally seeing reason. No. This is such a long fucking walk. Okay, I'm assuming we're going up to his Go cabin. Go up to his cabin, yeah. Lenora! Oh, it's nice to see you. Huntsman? Lenora. Where'd you... Why was his face masked I for a second? I don't know. Where'd you run off to? You're lucky your mother wasn't around or she would have bitten off my head. Did Avil tell her to go to sleep? I don't think he did. He just might be the nicest kid. Yeah, exactly. Everyone All else right. told her to go to sleep, and he didn't. That's why he tr she trusts him. I also just realized he has pointed ears. He does. Don't play dumb with me, Huntsman. I talked to your brother, Avil. I know what you are. You could have just killed him by surprise. I'm mixing all my voices up. Yep. My brother. But I am. I don't know what you're talking about, little Carolyn. I don't have a brother. I'm just a lonely hunter who lacks tannin wolf hides. You may remember keeping your village safe. Huntsman, the alpha wolf told me everything. Stop making a fool of yourself and admit you're not who you say you are. The audio from the mic dips in and out. Oh, I forgot to turn off my... There, it should stop now. Why did you have that on? Uh, So that I couldn't pick you up in the background when you were gotcha. at your other mic. Gotcha. This is rich, little Laura. You have quite the imagination. Stop all your nonsense and come to your senses. Hey, haven't you ever heard the wolves are coming? Cunning? Coming? Coming? <laughs> Not as much as they foxes, They will be coming course, after, after this. <laughs> suffice to say, a wild animal will do anything to save its hide. That wolf knows you're a naive little girl that lied right to your face. This is part of why I told you to stay behind. You must never trust the words of a wolf. Then, then why is it still alive? You said you were going to end this once and for all. Why did you let the poor thing live? Lenora, it hurt me just as much as I hurt it. 
simply rest until I can go back and finish the job. Huntsman, you don't have a scratch on you. Do you honestly expect me to believe- Listen, little girl, I won't hear any more crazy talk from you. This was cute at first, but it's gotten upsetting. Let's focus on the positive, okay? There are a lot of wolves out tonight, so you should stay here for the time being. I'll cook you a hot breakfast in the morning. Just sit and calm down. Wolves can be scary, I know, but you're safe with me, so just relax. Huntsman, I'm not- I'm going to the back room to freshen up, alright? Sit by the fire and I'll be back before you know it. Tomorrow I'll get rid of that mangy wolf for good. He's gonna come back out as a wolf. Yep. Well, what should I do now? Which is the right choice? Go after him or trust him? Chat! We have to do this all again if we choose a different thing. We do. Should we just go after him? Yeah, I, listen. This game looks very good. It's, but yeah. But I'm honestly kind of bored. I very much am as well. So we're gonna... It's, I mean, again, I'm following along with it, but it's just... There's, it doesn't really have anything for it in the way of story. There's nothing yeah. really interesting there. Yeah, no. And we'll, then it tried to do an interesting plot twist, but it was not. No. And we'll we'll discuss it fully once it's over. Yeah. But yeah, no, I feel that. Something still isn't right, and I won't let him walk away from this. Wow. I never would have seen that coming. Whoa. There's mutilated wolf corpses everywhere. Lenora. Huntsman. You really shouldn't be back here, my girl. It shows the ugly side of hunting. Nothing fit for a little girl like you to see. Can you stop acting like I'm a child? This wolf situation is serious, and I need answers from you right now, Huntsman. Little Lenora, this is ridiculous. Do you want me to tell your mother how troublesome you're being? Why won't you listen to me? The Alpha Wolf said... The Alpha Wolf will be dead tomorrow. Doesn't matter what he said. I go back around and leave this room this instant. I'm not leaving until you take me seriously and answer me. So start talking, Kane. Kane? Yes, I suppose that is my name, isn't it? Oh. Listen, little girl, I did. I killed those wolves because they're better off dead. Evil and I fought for over control of the pack for years upon years. I decided I'd end it by killing them all instead. That is a nice spray, though. Yeah. Hiding as a human hunter makes executing them so much easier, you see. Grants a lot of power to one who deserves it, I might add. Plus, isn't it a service to you if I hunt down all those wolves? Your village will be safe or something. Those wolves are attacking the people I love right now because of you. They never attacked us before you started hunting them. That is true. But what if I told you I don't actually care? Oof. You humans are just as stupid as my old pack. Might as well kill all of you too. You'll all be less of a headache, that's for certain. What? What about the village? You helped protect us. After all these years, how could you turn on us like that? Must there always be some deep, dark reason to do the things I do? I said it before and I'll say it again. I don't care about your little hovel you call a village. Or the people in it. Never have. Plus, I might as well admit to you, I'm the wolf who killed the Baron's wife. And then I killed one... Hi, dubstep. Then I killed one of the pack and brought him to the pelt so he would trust me. I've been stalking the Hollow's villagers ever since. It's fun. And in fact, I actually planned on killing the rest of you anyway once I was done with my idiot brother and his pack of mongrels. So I hope you told your family goodbye, because you're going to be the second person I've killed from this stupid little village. No, you're not. Right? You're going to not do this. You know, Lenora, you're a pretty impressive huntress. You've already done a lot of my work for me. I've even considered letting you in on my plan once I kill my brother. Oh well. You're not that special anyway. I'll make sure to haul your corpse to town when I'm through with you. Your mother's just your girl one last time before she dies. Where's there's like, like a small. Ma. Oof. Oh shit. That does a lot of damage. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, this guy's gonna have so much health. Ah, oh, shit, I'm already... But you got a shit ton of items, though. I do, yeah. You're such a foolish girl, Lenora. You really think you'll live through this? I'll rip your body to shreds. Oh. Ew. I can't do any... I guess I can, it's just all... It's glitchy it's and broken. It's very glitchy and broken.
That's strange. No, nope, I want this, please. Okay, game, I'll give you credit. You piqued my interest again. I mean, the story is still shit, but you know, you, <laughs> you piqued my interest again. <laughs> I say that as a joke, by the way, because these are supposed to be, uh, you know, uh, what's, I cannot think of the word. I don't know. Constructive. Yes. The story is not shit. It's just, there's a lot of blandness to how it's delivered. I would agree with that. That's... But for the sake of the joke, I'll say it's shit. Yes, of course you will. Um, uh, okay. But I do like this. This is cool. This weird glitch thing that just doesn't seem right. It looks cool. Just this combat is just so much slower than um, Offs's. I just noticed now. Yeah. I don't have anything. I need to... I didn't need that. I should have done... No. Because there's just a lot more. Because usually an Off you have abilities that will heal you, and your PP lasts so much longer. Mm -hmm. Like it's gone in like two seconds with this one. But hey, at least there the PP goes. moves are doing more damage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So they sort of fixed it towards the end, but the early axes, it doesn't make sense to do it. No, yeah. Mm -hmm. I was successful. Lenora stood above Kane's corpse, her ax slathered in his blood. He really was gone. She returned to Avil and gave the axe back to him, her job done. Gratefully called off his pack and promised he wouldn't let them rummage through the rampage through the forest again. Lenora and Avil soon returned to Pokeweed Hollow together and the two of them told the villagers the truth about Cain and the attacks. While Avil's strange appearance had caused distrust and scared the villagers at first, Lenora convinced them that he wasn't a threat. They soon forgave him and his pack for the attacks. With the whole village breathing a sigh of relief, peace returned to the hollow once more. Lenora's prowess at hunting inspired Miss Stonecrop to begin hunting anew, and with Abel's help, the three of them protected the village and the forest together. From what? I don't know. With Lenora's bravery, Abel's brute strength, and Miss Stonecrop's wisdom and experience, Pokeweed Hollow was soon the safest village in the countryside. Safest from what? And of course they fell in love. As years went by, Lenora found a true friend in Abel, the Alpha Wolf. No, they're just friends. They remained close for years to come and establish a bond between humans and wolves that triumphed over the test of time. They're just friends. No, they fucked. No, just friends. They fucked. Huntress. I take it that's kind of the true ending. Yeah, of course. Yes, okay. So the music they did find. They found the music for it? Yes, they did not make gotcha. it. And they sort of just slowed it for each yes. thing, I'm mm -hmm. assuming. Thank you for playing. From lawyers this and insurance the, salesmen. The bonus room. There's a bonus room. Oh, okay. It's just one of these little bonus rooms where you get to talk to everybody and see all the sprites and stuff. Mm -hmm. Okay, sweet. Well, in that case, we'll let this sit Thoughts. on. The art style is good. I like the character sprite designs, especially their little face portraits. They're very good and they're very creative. The enemy design was also very creative. I um, wish I could see more. Honestly, like, I wish I could see more. Yeah, I wish there were more than three different enemy sprites. Um, I mean, I think the werewolves did have a little bit of variation in them. But they, it was the same no, it character was either with different sitting, positions. Sitting, standing, and then depending on the area, their eye color was different. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All of the images for each werewolf was the same. Yeah. Which mm -hmm. sucks because, and I know it's just supposed to be a bunch of wolves, but that just means that there's nothing well, in the levels other like, than color. I'm gonna come I'm gonna compare it to off because it's, off I think that's is, sort of where yeah. it takes its inspiration. It does from. definitely where it takes inspiration off. Off has the same enemy throughout the game. It's just these suit guys that have glops coming out of him. But in every area they do something different with it. Like first they start kinda peeking out and then they start kinda coming out, like and then they're geysers, and then there's a huge like fucking bug ahead man that comes out of it. It's it's the same yeah, concept, it's but the same just concept. drawn differently or doing different things. Yes. Even if it was just the same werewolf in a different pose, it would have just been a nice thing to just not make it a monotonous, like, oh yeah, it's the same werewolf, yes. same werewolf, same yes. werewolf. 
I believe, um, I'll read gerbils really quick and then I'll continue. I think the decisions need more depth to them. There's no real point in having a decision if choosing that decision immediately ends the game. That is kind of the style of game that does happen a lot um, in these types of games. What I have contention with is that it was very obvious which one you were supposed to choose. Yeah, and so it got to the point where you would do the other one just to see what happens. But the outcome of it was just, just another everyone ending. dies. Okay, now go back and do it yep. again and do mm -hmm. what you're supposed to do. And then you go to the next decision and you try it out and it's, everyone dies. Yep. All right, now go back and yep. do what you were supposed to well, do. Well, let's get to the story in a second though. Let's talk about some of the game mechanics and stuff yep. first before we get into the story. I feel like the level. system- I obviously system, wasn't playing, right. so I can only gather for what I watched. Well, and plus, but... and plus, because I am gonna compare it to off because that's what it's trying to be is off. Off's combat is a lot quicker, um, mostly because you don't have to use items so much. Um, you're not as reliant on items because some of your little special attacks heal you. Your uh, PP lasts way, way longer, uh, and they actually make a big, solid difference. Like your puny, like your attack can work, and it's often good to spam your attack a couple times in boss fights just to preserve some of your PP. But then, the special attacks are often for large groups of enemies more so than anything because they can attack everybody at once. So then you you, you use a little extra to get some of the attacking. Yeah, them. I mean. They, uh, not maybe towards the beginning, but towards the end, they started, the specials started having a bigger play in it. Yes. Which I liked. You're right, though. Like, one special would use up, like, half, half of your of it. Yep. PP Whereas bar. the same attack in off would have used up probably about a tenth of your bar, maybe. Yeah. But it slows the combat down because you have to take a whole turn to yep. get PP, and it might not even give you enough to mm -hmm. use the attack yeah, you want to use. No, and sometimes you had to take multiple off items. You at the like at the end of the game, you had probably about eighty PP. You could use one item, heal most of that, so you could keep going again because it kept the combat exciting and adrenaline rushing and up because you have to because it makes you try to press faster, it makes you try to press as fast as you can. Where in this one, it's like. All right, I gotta use this again. I gotta go back and I can use this again. I gotta use this again. Okay, now I can attack. And but the enemies didn't attack as often. And off they attack quite frequently too. And they don't do a lot of like the big. The numbers are a lot bigger, so they don't do quite as much damage. But it's, well, that's the thing. I feel like they could have tweaked the health and damage so that they could have sped up the pace and let you mm -hmm. use more stuff mm -hmm. without having because it seemed. And I know it's a little girl wheeling an X, so maybe clunky was kind of what you wanted, but yeah. it mm -hmm. seemed rather clunky trying to sit back and wait to recover, to just use yes. one more attack, and then sit back and recover again, mm -hmm. and waste all these yep. items just trying to do a basic, like, yes. not basic attack, but, you know, a special attack. Yes, mm -hmm. I agree fully. And then the leveling system I thought was kind of weird. There was no leveling system. It was just well, when mean, you got a new axe. When you got axe, a new axe, you which leveled up, essentially. I totally get, right? Because that's yeah. how it would work. I get you why get they do axe. that, but that makes it so there's no point in fighting the anything. wolves at all. Yeah. There's it's, no point in fighting anything. Yeah. You should just go past them because you'll just waste your resources trying to fight them. Correct. Which is not a good game design in a game that's supposed to be about fighting wolves. Well, it's also the fact that the battles become item item management. Yeah. <laughs> so literally, wolves are just there to take your resources. Yes. Which I guess, but like, it's not a good like if you're designing your game based off of managing resources to do special attacks, mm -hmm. having enemies that the only point is to waste your resources to recover. Mm -hmm is unfortunate because it just makes them tedious instead of actually threatening. Yes. Yes. My life's a gerbil. Did you ever make it to level two? No. No. Uh, we were level one the whole time, but when we got a new axe, we'd it get more our HP stats. and we'd get more abilities and stuff. Yeah. Um. All right. I, anything else about the gameplay? Do you gameplay. Think? Um. I think that about covered what I wanted to say about it. No. I mean, I guess the only thing I could also say about gameplay, and I covered it a little bit. But when you make a decision that automatically ends the game, mm -hmm. having to do the section again- Let you save right before you is make the really decision. really tedious, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Like, or have it save either on the decision or, mm -hmm. like there's a lot of ways you can do it. Mm -hmm. Danganronpa did a perfect way where they 
made you make a decision and then if you did the wrong decision it just it would right it would spiral off and then it would go ah i can't think about that now i need to make a decision and mm -hmm. then it would put the decision back up mm -hmm. and then you would do it again but it didn't do it in such a way that was like no you made the wrong decision go back it gave you a little bonus for like looking at this clearly decision. wrong decision yeah. but but yeah that's the thing is it the decision making felt more like a punishment for not doing what the developer wanted you mm -hmm. to do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So if that's the case, why make the decisions at all? I think because I can give a little insight on this because I'm I play a lot of these RPG games. I mean, it's to keep you games. invested, right? It's to make... No, actually that's not really the point. RPG maker games, especially the horror games are known for having multiple endings. Um and so they need so ending material. So they need ending material. Except, but that's the thing, all the endings were the same. Yeah, but Everyone the point dies. but the point is to find all the endings. The goal is to find all the endings. But and it doesn't matter no, what the like concept I, is. I it's get, just I get the yeah. concept. Don't mm -hmm. get me wrong. No, it was not executed it's, well. It's unfortunate when all of the endings but the actual ending are the same. Yes. Everyone dies. Yes. The town goes to ruin. Everyone dies. Yes. And that's just how it is every single bad ending. Mhm. Mm I agree fully with that. Um, as for the story, I think that you had something at the beginning, right? Mm -hmm. It was, you know, a town plagued by wolves. The little girl has to it's travel It's a good across. setup, yeah. It's a nice setup. And then you can play Lamp Simulator now. <laughs> um, they just never really did enough with it. They just well, kind of... No, it just became, okay, the little girl who... Yeah, that way the ending actually... There should be more work that needs to be done for each ending. That way the ending actually yes. feels earned. Yeah. yeah, like a good example I can have is Eve, which kind of started the whole trend of having multiple endings. In Eve, you have two companion characters. And those of you who watch Buffs to Keep Play will kind of know this. You have two companion characters who you can talk to at any point. You can turn around, you can talk to them. And essentially, there's this invisible number system that you build friendship with them. And as finding a certain items and getting enough friendship with them, you can find very specific odd little endings buried away. Like if you're like, you know, there's the one character, Mary, who is going to murder you. If you have enough friendship with her, I believe she doesn't murder you. Or, you know, if you have enough friendship with Gary, he remembers you in the museum after the game ends and you get different endings. Uh, John Hummel, was this last game a demo or a full game? Do we know if the choices might branch into more thought out endings? I believe it is the full this game. This is the full game. I do if not I think I remember it's a demo. correctly. Yes. This is the full game, which is. Honestly, which is why we're giving it so much, uh, like, critique. which is why we're putting so much critique on it mm -hmm. is because all the other ones were demos, and you can kind of judge a demo, but you, you can can't kind of judge, judge a demo, fully. but you can't say stuff like those endings are wrong mm -hmm. because they, you're right, they might branch off more. But it's the fact that this is a complete game, which means that everything needs to it doesn't have to be perfect, but everything mm -hmm. needs to be where it should be. Yes. And I feel like a lot of the stuff just isn't. Yes. Yes. Um, if you get in a friendship with Mary, then she becomes a real in place of Gary. That's right. They become sisters. Um, but yeah. But just... And the writing feels... Coming from a writer, because I can talk about this. The writing feels yeah. kind of amateurish in a little bit of a way. Just because the twists were all very obvious. Um, you know, the fact that, oh, the wolf, the big bad wolf is actually good is something that's been done a lot before. You know, it's... And I did like how they handled Kane. I did like that final room. The fu Okay, let me let me go on that. Because, again, we've been talking... No, I wouldn't even say harsh, right? Because this is stuff that you have to think about yeah. as a game developer. Mm -hmm. As a game developer, I mm -hmm. think about these kind of things. Yeah. Of course, and I've never in, made something like this. Keep in mind, this, if but... the dev ever ends up watching this, the fact that we finished the game means that it wasn't a bad game. No, I don't think this is a bad game. No, I can see a lot of potential, especially mm -hmm. with how good the art style yes. is. Mm -hmm. And I think just touching up the battles, making battles a little more unique yes. would be a nice start towards moving. Because mm -hmm. the thing is, is like, even if the writing doesn't necessarily carry it, mm -hmm. having the battles be slow and monotonous sort of drags down the pace of an already yep. slow narrative. Yep. Whereas you could also put more effort in the storyline where the battles just sort of impede it. Mm -hmm. But once you get past them, you have something to look forward to other than just sort of the same mm -hmm. thing. Yep. Like you said, having the wolf at the end be the good guy and having the good guy be the bad guy is kind of overdone mm -hmm. a lot, specifically with the big bad wolf. Yes. Um... But it makes sense because that's what you're going for. Yeah. I mm -hmm. would just say there's probably different ways yes. that you could have done it. I think also the dialogue itself didn't have a lot of spark. Like, and 
this is bad. This is not good critique because there's no way I can really tell you how to fix it because either you're good at dialogue or you're decent at dialogue. It's, it's it might seem mundane when an electric assortment of sprites can add a special charm to a game. Yes, exactly, right? Like that. if mm -hmm. all of the wolves were different, mm -hmm. it automatically adds something that wasn't there before. Yes. Like every it seems like every area has just that little extra thought put into it mm -hmm. versus just oh, it's the same area with a different color palette mm -hmm. yes. and different strength wolves that yes. look kind of the same, you know what I yes. mean? Mm -hmm. But as you were saying, um, I think, the, again, it's weird because at the beginning, there was a lot of life yeah. in the characters. Mm -hmm. And as the game went on, everything just became the same and everyone seemed very mm -hmm. dull. Well, the fact as well that when we first did the voice of the villagers, neither of us could remember which voice we'd given which character because they all kind of blended together a little bit. I mean, to be fair, all the, it's mostly because all the voices I was doing were about I the could, same. I couldn't remember either. I was just yeah. bullshitting. But yeah, I mean, well, it's also just the fact that these characters, you're just sort of thrown into these characters, yes. mm -hmm. which that's not an issue no. for me because in a, something like this, if you had too much character building at the beginning, it would have slowed it, it down. It would have slowed down more. even more. Yeah, that wouldn't have been um, good. But. but I think my issue with it was Jet for and I don't really have a reason for it. For some reason, the beginning was actually pretty good. I mm -hmm. was kind of invested at first, mm -hmm. and then it just slowly sank in on itself and became just sort of. I think it's it, because we got out of more of the story-heavy sections and it, got yeah. more into the actual gameplay, and it like got if you had carried that because it did have an energy at first. If you yeah. had carried it throughout, it might mm -hmm. have been better and it might have kept up the pace a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, but if you, like, unfortunately, a lot of the interest and commentary came from us sticking around and not necessarily yes. the character's presence in this. Yes. In the story. Like, Grandma was my favorite part, and that was only funny because we made her really funny. Yeah. It and was, you voiced her. <laughs> yeah. But it was basically just every single character that you met was, oh, hey, go to sleep. Here's an axe. Yes. And like, if you took away the images, they all the characters would seem the same. Yes, that's that's my thing. Is it's just I feel like there wasn't enough the diversity within the characters. There wasn't enough diversity to separate within them. the enemies and, that's, and the characters. That's kind of what I'm trying to get with with the whole dialogue thing. Is that all the characters kind of talked very similarly? I think this might be translated. I don't know if it's originally in English, which could be part of the reason. That could also be potentially that could part be of part of the reason. the reason. If it is originally in English, though. Um, the fact that the characters all kind of talk very similarly means that... Yeah, the only one that's different is the hunter. And yeah. that's also how you know that the hunter is more important mm -hmm. than everyone else. And then mm -hmm. the moment he says, someone among you is bad, you immediately it's go, the well, the only person that I can remember is the hunter. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Which is unfortunate. But but yeah, but this is not a bad game at all. No, the I... The art style is really pretty. The graphics are really nice. It's... And... To capture some good points, and we talked about them throughout the playthrough, mm -hmm. the transitioning between the levels was very nice. Really good. It was the very fact nice. that the moment you cross over that line, every like they took the time to make all of the menus and stuff different colors, mm -hmm. your character yes. different colors, yes, uh, the environment different colors, the wolf's eye. Yeah, I, again, I wish there were more sprites, but mm -hmm. just also making the wolf's eyes different colors. Mm -hmm. It's cool how the whole color palette it's cool changed, how but everything worked changed really as well. Through. Mm -hmm. Um, and again, that last fight with him when it all freaked and glitched out and yeah. staticky mm -hmm. was a cool but moment. Because again, is, though, with something that was so sort of yeah. streamlined, having that weird glitch bump in the middle but was like. The thing is, though, what was the purpose of it? It didn't really seem to serve a purpose within the narrative or anything. I mean, it was a cool moment, but it would have had a lot more impact if there was a reason for it to happen. I mean, you actually, that is a very fair point. It just sort of happens. That's also probably why it was so surprising. Mm -hmm. Because, like, and again, I think it's supposed to show that he went crazy and was yes. just this monster. Yes, that's fair. But it, we knew that already. If I think if the glitch had started before the fight happened and if he had had a little breakdown and gone, uh, uh or done some yeah, stuff like, and the glitch happened. if he had a breakdown happen, before the battle started and then it went into the glitch fight, that would, would have make more sense. It would have sort of made it a little more fluid mm -hmm. instead yes. of just because there was a fight at the beginning first when he was all shadowed out. Yeah. But I think that was what they were trying to do, right? They were trying to make him a generic sort of fight and then mm -hmm. all of a sudden he 
turns into the light and he's crazy and yes. staticky yes. which is cool but i think you could have maybe done it a little more fluidly mm -hmm. but it was a cool moment yes uh maybe the longer she fights the wolves the more terrified of them she becomes also explain different wolf appearances as if she starts imagining wolves become more scary and aggressive this explains the environment color changing that's that's a cool fair. idea that'd be yeah. a really cool idea anyway we're starting to nitpick now though so we should we should yeah. probably um, but, say a couple well, good things but, and then but no, and I mean, but nitpicking is what you, like, because we're not sitting here going, your game is bad, you no, can't fix it. No, not at all. I wish, this is why I sort of do this, right? Because if the game developer ever sees this, mm -hmm. they can, I hope yeah. you know that we're not just tearing your game apart. No, and I don't think, I don't think we are. I you mean, probably, I mean, I'm assuming you wouldn't have seen the channel before this, but she's a writer, I'm a game developer, mm -hmm. so. We're both we, the two sides of game developing. We just so. sort of, I, I like to point things out because a lot of the times you don't get this kind of mm -hmm. critique. Mm -hmm. It's either your game is flawless or your game is shit. Yep, and there's, because honestly, yeah, that's a lot of what the internet is. There's a lot of people who either say you're a goddess and I love you or your game is the best or your game is And so sh while I enjoyed this game, there was a lot of things that I noticed. And so yep. I'm trying to get them across to you because if you ever decide to update it. Or make another game. Or make another game, mm -hmm. these are things you can either change or learn from. Yep. Mm -hmm. But again, there were a lot of good things too, and I we pointed those out throughout yes. the thing. And again, the environment changes, a lot of the sort of sound decisions. Yes, we're very uh, good. Very good. Yes, I feel like the presentation of this game was very, very oh, good. Oh, exactly. The art style yes. and stuff, the visuals, the presentation, mm -hmm. very good. But I feel like some of the inner mechanics and the inner workings of it were probably not maybe well, with the game, but maybe not tested as much as they well, should have been. Well, I was gonna been. say you can tell that it's an and I mean, obviously I'm making an assumption here, but from my, what I see, it's an artist making a game. That is what it, it seems like, yes. It doesn't seem like a game developer because they maybe would have adjusted certain things a certain way. Mm -hmm. As the artist, the presentation is very clean and very nice, mm -hmm. but behind it, there's just those things that you don't get because you're not a game mm -hmm. developer. Like, or you're not a writer. Right, like mm -hmm. e even in some of my games, the writing isn't necessarily fantastic. Mm -hmm. It's just because I'm not a writer. I don't think that way. And if I ever tried to make a game, I mean, I couldn't make a game because you the would... visuals would be absolute fucking Well, yeah, garbage. but that's the thing. Like, but, even <laughs> if, but if you try to make a game, the writing would be flawless. Mm -hmm. But the but... gameplay probably wouldn't be as strong. And even if you had like artistic assets, mm -hmm the way that you would approach making a game mm -hmm. isn't the way that a mm -hmm. game developer might. So yep. you, there's just differences. Which is why I think sometimes the best indie games come about when a small group of people get together. Like you have someone on a writer credit, you have someone on the programming credit, you have someone on the art credit. Yeah, but I mean also in its defense, the game is programmed very well. No, it is. Well, to be fair, RPG Maker, you don't really program it. You kind of just input stuff into it. I mean, that's I mean, you that's can fair. you can program that's if you fair. want to. Uh, I I mostly mean because obviously it's RPG Maker, but I mm -hmm. mostly mean how because they have to sort of fuck with the numbers a little bit, right? Like yes, they have to fuck with the numbers. So at that's least. what I mean. Like they at least have a good understanding of how it should work. Yes, but just not there's that little gap that you just really can't cross without yeah. having mm -hmm. that sort of mm -hmm. either having or learning that that knowledge. Yep. And that's honestly the point, that is a good point about the artists because I was trying to figure out, because it seems like there's a lot of indie games that have this thing where the presentation is very good, sometimes the gameplay is very good, but I always find the story to be kind of generic and I wonder why that is. And I realize now that it's because they're either an artist or they're a game developer and they're not like a writer. So they can't because, really put yeah, that little- Yeah, because a writer probably wouldn't make a game. They'd just write it. Yes. They'd write the story. Yes. Yes. Uh, if you want a beautiful game, try Trial of Light. The story isn't half bad, in my opinion, as well. The fight mechanics are also fun for me. Maybe a good buff sticky game. Um, I can't remember if Child of Light is on Steam or not. I know it's on Switch. Um, and I have a capture card now. So if it's only on Switch, I can play it. Um, that is a good recommendation. I have wanted to play Child of Light for a while, so I will put it on my list. Thank you very much. I played it I played it in a store once. I think it was in a Best Buy, and my parents were looking yeah. at something. So I went and I just played the demo of it for a little while. <laughs> also, fun. this game took us to our quota. It did. Look at that. It is on Steam. Awesome. I'll add it to my wish list. Thank you very much. I did not realize it was. But, was. yeah, no, I mean, honestly, pretty good games all around. Yes. Um, going back to just the ones we played before, nothing great. Yeah. It was a nice, quirky little experience mm -hmm. that sort of played to video game tropes. And the yes. fact that it was made for a game jam yes. just shows that it's, it was a time limit project. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, Soul uh, was had amazing a art lot, style. Soul had a lot of potential. It did, yes. It. I feel like it'd be a great bigger part of a yeah, or a smaller part to, of a big game. It needs game. to be included in something bigger to make it work. But it has it can basically go in any direction and it would be flawless. Yes. Um, and then Turnip Boy. Turnip was, Boy was fantastic. Fucking I, Turnip Boy. On, again, I didn't even. I'm gonna. Really have I'm gonna. Wrong I'm gonna it. follow that developer because I want to see the full game when it comes out. Absolutely. That's and what I'm following. To, you'll have to let me know that I will. it comes out. Maybe we'll play it on stream. Maybe Buffski can play it because mm -hmm. that'd be pretty fun. That'd be a fun Buffski game. Um, um, if you haven't played Inside, I recommend a whole other movie. I've watched like two different playthroughs of Inside. Uh, that'd be an interesting game to play as Buffski. I feel like I need somebody to co-host with me though because I don't think because it's kind of long and there's stuff that happens, but there's not and maybe quite enough Inside, for Buffski to I interact feel like with. I'd have heard of it it's I, it's the game it's the game by the guys who made limbo um it's the kid with yes, the red shirt yes 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 yeah. yes okay mm -hmm. i was yep. wondering yeah i was like because it's because it is that kind of like like puzzly like side scroller game but there's not quite enough in enough between to make commentary to make good commentary about yeah. it because i'm not if you guys have noticed i'm not the strongest at that that's why i co mm -hmm. have co-hosts so often because i'm not really all that good at keeping up commentary <laughs> i need this guy to fill in for me <laughs> pee pee Great. Okay. Quick play lamp simulator. No. <laughs> <laughs> Shut the fuck down. <laughs> and I think with that, Damn. with that, we're gonna we're gonna end the stream for tonight. Fifteen minutes. Fifteen minutes early. It's not bad at all. So thank you everybody so much for joining us. Um, we will see you all next time. I don't when, know if we'll stream next I'll, week. I'll make a I'll make a point real quick though. Okay. When this comes, when this becomes like a live video. Yeah. Go into the comments. Put games that are on itch or something, little yes. indie games that you might want to see in one of these. Yes, because we have do. a whole list. But I like, have two hundred and fifty games. She also has a very specific niche. Yes, <laughs> and that also defeats the purpose of this, which is to play things we wouldn't normally play. So if you have little yes. indie games that you'd want to see, mm -hmm. to be them, fair, to be fair, there are some that I just won't really play. Like if it's like I see a lot of like not, twin stick shooters or like Metroidvania yeah. games on itch. Well, which I, I'm just, I know. I'm, I'm not just saying. Play. But yeah. I cuz it, it also again because we would look at a game and maybe go we wouldn't add it to the list but then when someone else recommends it we go okay well why did they do it? That's fair. And then look at it further. That's fair. So I would do that if I were you. If you want to see yeah. a specific game. If there's indie a game, game you want to see um put the itch link down in the description uh or the steam link and or I'll just definitely even the name. Yeah, I'll at the very least look it up. At the very least. Cuz that's the other thing. We're just trying to find games that need some Need some, some loving. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. That's the goal of the series is to do that. Or critiquing. Or critiquing, yeah. Because mm -hmm. hopefully eventually there'll be enough people following me that um, I'll actually it'll get actually some people. Get it'll actually get Yeah, it'll actually do something for it. Um, Slight update for the people that, because I'm assuming the people that watch these tend to watch all of them. Oh, I'm sure. The game we played, Strobophagia. Yes! Talk to them about yes, that. So because there's more going on with that so, at the moment. So I don't have a link to it off the top of my head, but they have a Twitter called Strobophagia. Um, they, the, we played the demo, and it is currently That's the being, one where you were wandering through the yes, woods, there was neon lights. There was neon and lights and everywhere, creepy, there were creepy people. Things. It was a rave. Um, it was huge. There was a bunch of Bacchic symbols there. Um, it's being developed. They have a Discord server. They have a very active Discord server with, the, like, a, a, the developers are very active on it, and they like to talk with, with people. Um, they're uploading the soundtrack slowly. Uh, they're constantly having updates. They're good. I think they're having a big update pretty soon. The guy on it's their YouTube like, is really funny. He's really funny. Yeah, they're, they're kind of spokesperson. Um, so please, please go check them out. And go they check them are, because we were talking about optimizing with them, and they mm -hmm. are working on that, actually. Yes. And I'd like to think we had a hand. Um, we <laughs> Totally they didn't. did. They, they did comment on on the post I left on their because I I linked the video into their right. comments and they commented on it. There and we they go. Had, we they did had clearly it. watched the video because That's I think cool. they left a couple specific remarks about their it. Their Twitter account is Strobophagia. Yeah. Yes. Dribble's got it there. Yes. But no, just something fascinating because again, just a little playing of the video and we just sort of got to see this small project blow up, mm -hmm. which is just mm -hmm. cool. Well, yeah, because I think I played it and a couple other people played it and it actually does have a pretty sizable following. Your Discord server in about two weeks, I think, is now the size of ours. So, yeah. Because our channel is dying. dying. Uh, <laughs> uh, but yeah, but follow them. Do it, please. They're, it's a really cool game. Yeah, and I'm really you, excited to see If it you all. haven't seen it, go back to. I think it's the, number. It wasn't the last one. It was the one before, right? Was it? I thought it was the last one we did. It might have been the last. Because the one before was the Halloween one. 
correct. So it was the last one. It, it might have been. If it wasn't the last one, it might have been the one before. Look for strobophagia. You'll see a weird. I think it's episode neon four. Neon design. I think it's episode four. Uh, but watch it because it was actually pretty interesting. It was a really good game. And then follow it. Yeah. Follow it on Twitter. Go to their Discord server. I'm there. You can say hi to me on their Discord server. Yeah. <laughs> Just be like, is that the world-renowned angry, angry hedgehog? hedgehog? Whoa, crazy. Yeah, embarrass her, please. Yes, in, do it. In front of the dogs, I do it. I dare you. Fucking um, do it. But no, that just a fun little fact, because it was a game that was played on one yes. of these. So. Mm -hmm. Yes. And uh, if any of these games pique your interest, I have all the links in the description on itch below. I, a lot of them are demos, so they're being developed actively. Uh, please follow them. Please give them some love. Follow them, especially turn a boy commits tax evasion. Go commit tax evasion. Go commit tax evasion. Not in the game, real life. Yes, do it. Ventus, I'm talking to you. Tax evasion. I'm talking to you. Uh, all right. So with that, I think we're going to say farewell. Have a good evening. Good night, everyone. Good night, everyone. We'll see you all soon. Thank you so much for joining us. Tax evasion!